All right, Mike. we are live. Yeah. How's it going, guys? Uh, of Make course, sure we, we have, have Stuart our... here in the house. What a uh, unbelievable yep, honor it is. Place, yeah. We tried this once before. It didn't work we out so well. <laughs> we did. We did. We, I, I think we tried very hard, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Poor Jay. Jay. The odds were not in your That's favor. True. Noah and I won that yeah. bet. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you actually thought we wouldn't be able to do it. Yeah, we, oh, yeah. we placed bets. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. I won 50 bucks. Yeah. Yeah. You won 50 bucks? Holy yeah. cow. So, uh, so obviously, uh, Stuart is from Universal Rock. Uh, yes. Down in Garland, Texas, mm -hmm. the one that is the brain right. child behind. We are uh, live. The and all How's kinds of guys? Uh, so we appreciate we you. Have number one, you've been here in the house for the last uh, uh, three days. Of honor is right. We tried Fantastic. this once before. Yeah. It didn't work. Yeah. So I mean, <laughs> we did. We did. Yeah. 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 Ye
and they fit by like a quarter of an inch. Uh, well, yeah. Yeah. And, 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 and not only like they just fit, it, you're, you're dealing with thousand or more pounds yeah. with people that you never worked right. with before, Holding. wondering whether oh they're going to lose their fingers. Oh. It was terrible. It was terrifying. So we thought we've, we've <laughs> nailed it. We've got it this right. The first tank we take through, <laughs> there's like there's less than a quarter inch. <laughs> this ain't going to work either. Oh, oh. Literally, I, I, I actually watched the video, and we talked about this earlier. And we're, we're a little ahead on our videos now. We did this because we knew it was going to be a lot of work, so we wanted to get a few days ahead. So, unfortunately, people that are watching the vlog won't see it till, uh, what's today, Wednesday? Like Friday. Okay. Literally watching that okay. video. We had less than a quarter inch of clearance on some of these cages. Oh I mean, gosh. I'm thinking to myself, if we were just an, an inch taller, what would we have done? We, I mean, we would, I don't know what we would have done. And we could have easily just made all the cages an inch lower. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> right. we, but, but that was we, my fault. Though. We made it up. Yeah, that was my fault because I measured wrong. You know, right. I well, said we also, have, yeah. Also your stands. Well, yeah, I made stands <laughs> that were an inch too tall, and, and it was uh, that so. damn inch. I don't get it. Like, so he <laughs> says that he says yeah. that he's picked me up from the airport, and he says, "Oh, I've made all the stands for it," and he said, oh, "I've made them oh twelve inches instead of 11 I'm going. Well, that's no good. I just made, I, <laughs> I cut all of the stuff so it'd be quick. Yeah. And yeah, so that yeah, we Yeah, well, uh, we, we appreciate the fact out, that though. it worked it out. It all worked <laughs> out, and we had great people. Yeah. And, and yep. 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 So yeah, it, was, it, it huh. it's definitely been <laughs> one of the wildest three days of my life, to be honest with so you. So how did you miscalculate that? You know the <laughs> listen, size of the cage, listen, and I'm the not, size of the doorway. Listen, Linda, listen. <laughs> I don't get it. I didn't just. I don't, you need to need to put that up on the. That's yeah. fantastic. <laughs> listen, I, Noah. Yes. I didn't just miscalculate. Uh -huh. I thought we had like six inches. <laughs> Of extra no yes. and we were a quarter no. inch i thought what has my... he been telling you for you <laughs> yeah exactly well, yeah there must be yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, i don't know how to measure <laughs> no thank god thank god <laughs> oh my gosh no well it, regardless it worked out but that i was thinking i was literally thinking as i was watching the vlog that will come out this friday i was like what are the like the energy of the universe was like so perfect that if if like you said if it was an inch larger we would have been screwed if it was an yeah. inch shorter we would have been better but we are perfect <laughs> like perfect we and it was it was almost the same thing that happened with lucy's tank where it was like literally a quarter inch and uh you know if we didn't tell the world this they no one would know it was they like would, it was planned, yeah, they would think right? we were very clever <laughs> exactly. but it, it was so uh, we just ruined that no it's all right you know what it's about being real <laughs> yeah the, the, <laughs> Cheers to that. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, cheers. Yeah, cheers. Yeah, cheers. Yeah. cheers. Yeah. cheers. Coffee. <laughs> but I think it's, uh, you know, I, it's like I've said, you know, when it comes to what you do, like we would never have been able to do not even the first Reptarium, let alone the second one. Because originally I was planning on literally making wooden boxes, putting foam in there, gluing it in and carving it and then grouting yeah. it. And I, I would still be working on the first one. It, you know, there would have been impossible, not yeah. to mention it would have looked like crap compared to what it did. So yeah, it, it's pretty phenomenal. I'm so happy yeah. because when he was explaining it first, like I was, oh, I was not, I mean, I'd be on board because I'm just yeah. on board with it, but I, <laughs> I did not like the idea. I'm like, this is not good. Like it, it's going to be a nightmare, so much work. And like you said, like, yes, you can do it, but it's not going to look good. Right. Mm -hmm. And that's, that's what I love. I love about what we've done where you can put the hard work and effort and actually be happy. Right. Like yeah. I love, I right, love right. The, the, the old reptarium and I love what the new reptarium is mm, going to yep. be because you work yep. your butt yep. off and you got something amazing. Yep. And that's why I love you. Like Thank right you. from the start. Thank you. No, like when, when I met you and just talking to you and just your ideas are just like mine. Like, yep. you know, what you were saying about like, Disney and, yeah. and how they do everything to perfection. Exactly. Like so right. many people don't care right. about the details, right. Right. but I do. Yes. And when I do something, that's what I want it to be. And I'm so happy that we can achieve that with your help. Yeah. yeah. We well, wouldn't have been able to. No, never, yeah. never. Well, I couldn't keep the animals. So you, yeah. so you put the two, <laughs> two, two together and it's fantastic. Yes, together. We're amazing. <laughs> well, and uh, really quickly, I just wanted to say, Stephanie, uh, you're great. Again, uh, she, she donated $50 as well as uh, Trailblazer also. And Stephanie really uh, supported 
Noah. And I wanted to say thank you guys for the super chat. Obviously, I noticed more uh, New Caledonian Gecko content in recent vlogs, especially your question last week. Excited to see more of that. Yeah, absolutely. And as a matter of fact, we're going to do another project I'll be doing, which will be in one of the basements, will be a whole New Caledonian room, like almost like a miniature reptarium, not big cages, but for New okay. Caledonian well, you geckos. Want to fit them so. down the stairs. No, no, no. Yeah, we're <laughs> small, small enclosures that aren't that much. You measure uh, it. You yeah, measure I'll it. measure it. I got the tape measure this time. Okay. <laughs> yeah, please. But, uh, um, and, and I know some, torch. I know some people that, uh, uh, you know, I saw a couple comments in the chat room about, oh, you guys only, you know, a take questions from super chat. What it is, is at the end of the podcast, we'll take some questions from people, but it's okay. impossible to really keep up with all the questions. So we'll check in in super chat, get yeah. some stuff here and well, there, but, uh, why is uh, everyone giving you money? I don't get this. Yeah, <laughs> I know. It's, What's going on here? Because it's cause you're they, here, they know it, they know we're broke after uh, <laughs> yeah. doing, doing the reptarian, but, uh, but it's not just animals with you. That's the thing, right? Yep. I mean, it's cool that you, you know, you're, you're, you're an, you know, you used to keep turtles when you were younger. So, Bearded dragons. Bearded dragons. Yeah. Water dragons. And obviously if, if you guys haven't noticed a little bit of an Australian right. accent. So, <laughs> yeah. but I, I thought I was surprised you were born in New Zealand. So are you a Kiwi or are you an Australian? I had a Kiwi um, passport, but okay. I had to relinquish that way okay. back then. And oh, it's just okay. the Australian. I but, did not okay. know that. Yeah. yeah. I was only there for seven months. So. Oh, okay. Not, so you're not, more Australian not, than Australian. Kiwi. Yeah. Yes. Gotcha. But, uh, so, so what, you started keeping animals, but what was the genesis? Like, you know what I mean? It's like, obviously you went from somehow, you know, being interested in whatever it was to all of a sudden. You, so you're a landscaper, right? So, um, so yeah, keeping, keeping turtles and lizards and things, I, I would build the cages for mm -hmm. those. Um, and some were outside cages, mm -hmm. much like other parts of, of America where you could have things mm -hmm. all year. Right. Uh, Sydney was a little bit like that, even yeah. though it get a bit cold, get a but it was still there, okay. Yeah. And um, so I built some cages outside in, in just big pits with lizards right. in them. <laughs> and I like <laughs> it. I like it. <laughs> Noah would do that. I would. Probably. That's a nice and easy. Like, I'm just going to dig a hole. Yeah. yeah. I did. Stick a lizard in there. Yeah. I did. And some <laughs> rocks. Yeah. Right. Every day. For aesthetics. I, I, back, back then, we didn't have a place you could order your crickets and right. cockroaches. Every day, I'd be running around the paddocks <laughs> with a net catching <laughs> crickets. And that was my first job when I got home from school to catch crickets to feed yeah. my animals. Now, actually, Noah, awesome. we should think you should have you do that. Save us some bills on the leopard gecko yeah. bill. I'll buy you a net tomorrow. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck in winter. Yeah. I know. I Where would they even cricket. be? It? They're not here. Not exactly. Yeah. You yeah. have to gone. look for a long time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, so anyway, so my first job. So typically back at, at back in Australia in those days, you would, if you wanted to be a tradesman, like electrician, a yeah. plumber, a landscaper, what have you, you'd, you'd finish school at year 10. Yeah, and then you go to college one oh, okay. one day a week okay. uh, for three years, and you'd work the other four days on the job. Right, and I got a job as a landscape gardener. Okay, and um, it was lucky because that was sort of what I. It, it was hard. I didn't really know what I was wanting to do, but mm -hmm. when I did go into that field, I'm like, I love this. Right, mm -hmm. and uh, then at twenty, this is the real key to my my sort of knowing where i wanted to go at 20 years old i'm sitting in a pub drinking beer not to Secchi's, but I'm, I'm with a friend of mine peter and i said pete you know i'd love to go to america and he says i'll go with you <laughs> literally literally three months later we'd booked a trip and we flew into hawaii and san Fran uh, la and san francisco and las vegas new wow. orleans Niagara Falls, New York, wow. flew back wow. San Diego. That's a lot. <laughs> but yeah. but in, in that six weeks, we went to Disneyland and Disney World. Ah. Mm. And I'm just in awe of this place. Right. I'm mm. just like, well, why can't I do some of this? Right. Yeah. So I made a pact with myself that I'm going to learn how to make, make these rocks. And most of those were cement rocks where you'd wire and spray on site and mm -hmm. carve and everything. So I... Um, I didn't do anything about that. And then at about the age of 25, by that time I'm married and, and, and got a, two children and, and I'm like, oh, you know what I need? I need to learn how to do that rock, those rocks. And I had my own little landscaping business had from when I was 19 and a half years old with a friend of mine. So I, um, I all of a sudden decided I'm going to learn how to do this. I put a little bit of money away and I went to a garden show. Next thing you know, at the garden show, there's a guy selling videos on how to make rocks out of <laughs> concrete, rubble. Oh, nice. And um, I tackled him. I, I said, I don't want your video. <laughs> I paid him $5,000 to, 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 to come to my house oh, and te teach me how to make rocks. <laughs> Shit. And, <laughs> and, um, and then... And then Four years later, I quoted on the Rainforest Cafe in uh, oh, wow. in Dead. You've been to Sydney, yeah, yeah. Darling Harbour, yeah, yeah, yeah. We've so, stayed in Darling Harbour. Yeah. So I quoted on that, and um, 
I thought I had this job. I, I was rolling my hands together going, it's going to be uh, fun. There's rocks and trees and waterfalls. Yeah. Anyway, I didn't get the job. Oh, oh, crap. Broken hearted. Yeah. But that same day I didn't get the job. I was getting some latex. I was wanting to buy some latex to do some molds for my cement rocks. Mm -hmm. And the company I called up said, yeah, we, we, we partner up with an American company um, who's doing that job. And I said, you sell the materials? And they said, yeah. So I'm covered in cement. I'm filthy. I, I jump in my car. I drive, and I'm sitting with the board, the, the the owner of the company in the boardroom, watching videos on what you use polyurea and polyurethane yep. for. And um, next thing I've met, I met a gentleman four weeks earlier who had lots of money and lovely man, and he said, "I Let's do I, this. I see you keep coming to my factory, buying my materials to do <laughs> cement rocks." He says. Maybe we could do something together. He says, I go back and forth to America and I'm mm -hmm. looking at buying some molds to make rocks at the moment. And uh, anyway, I showed him this video. He came into the boardroom uh, the next day and uh, next thing we're in business. Universe wow. Rocks begun and that's that was it, 22 huh? years ago. Wow. Dang. That's crazy. See, I love that. And that's, that awesome. you know what, that's like I tell Noah, like you never know like what your end never. game's going to nope. be. And it's always fun to hear yeah. like and you know, how it Noah. comes. Yep. You know what? You just got to keep your hands and everything. Keep and going. the next thing you know, like yeah. when you're passionate about you. something, going, Noah used to do landscaping. I know I was going to yeah. say that. <laughs> I actually loved it. It you was, did. it was really fun. I loved, uh, like turning, uh, destroyed, broken down garden slash yep. yard into yep. something beautiful yep. that you work so hard on and be proud of it yeah well every time i pick up a, a real rock now i go now i know why i got into this stuff <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> so it's, so it's much lighter. easy like yeah. honestly it's just a joy you yeah. You, yeah you come and landscape someone's house and it's not all you know you don't have to i, I say this to the landscapers yeah. it's not about stopping what you're doing there's just things that you can do like disney couldn't be done with real rock if it, no. if right. it, mm -hmm. it would be incredible yeah. if yeah. anyone could do it it cost right. 10 times the amount but when yeah. you with artificial rocks and forming yeah. things up you can make any theme yeah and uh our product just because it's so light and durable you can do any theme easily yeah and that's the thing mm. uh, you know nice. like if you think about uh, you know <laughs> when you walk into to our building you would think it would take us a month to move you know i mean right. like you know with jackhammers and stuff right. like that you know we could strip every wall in there in three days you know i mean it's it's you know i'm not that we ever want no, to but no that but is I'm the beauty saying. but that is why we we also did what we did too yeah. yep. because you know we want we didn't want to have to be tied to this building you yeah because you never know and if we're going to get too big is, yeah exactly like like you said this can very easily be easily take the stuff down the cages move out it's it's no not, we're gonna you know, we're permanent. never doing that uh, <laughs> no crazy. i mean we're not i'm just saying <laughs> not at the end of this day three days <laughs> yeah, no no i'm kidding anywhere. no yeah at the end of <laughs> this day the last thing i want to do is move but uh no we could though if we wanted right. to that's the thing and that's that nice, was yeah. part of the whole thing because uh yeah and even to the like the the hobbyists i think that's what's so cool right because i've always said that uh, I, I personally, and this, I may be out of my mind, but I personally think like reptile keeping is evolving, right? So I always liken it to like a saltwater tank fishing, right? right. You know, keeping, uh, marine fish keeping. It's like someone will spend $2,000 on a cool tank to buy a $10 fish. In reptiles right. right now, it's like people will spend two thousand dollars on an animal and put it mm. in a ten got ten dollar right. aquarium. Right. But I think that that's changing, right? Okay. And so the next phase of reptile keeping, or it's already happening, you okay. know, is the naturalistic. Mm -hmm. But what's happening right now that's interesting is that there's really not a go to, right? Because and this isn't disparaging to other companies, but but like the the commercial companies you know, they've got a styrofoam backdrop that right. isn't going to survive, sure. you know, a, a, a monitor lizard or something like yep. that. So that's what I find interesting, even to the hobbyist that wants just a, a, a 30 gallon tank or a, right. whether it's fish or reptiles or whatever, it's like you give them an option that is like naturalistic, that's going to survive forever. It'll last yeah. longer than the aquarium. Right, exactly. It really will. Yeah. yeah. And that that's what I get excited about. I mean, when I come down and I think every time, Stuart, you tell me about like someone coming to your place and I know Lori, you were just there for the first time. I always tell people it's overwhelming. You get in there and it's just like, it is like it's huge. It's huge. It's, and it's, it, there's yeah. so much to, I mean, I don't, first off, I got to ask you, how does your place run? Because I've been there multiple times, like 10 times. I still don't know. I mean, it's like you got your little Oompa Loompas making rocks all day. I don't know where they're going. I don't know what is going on with this. I mean, what, 
orders come in and, and they pull the out of those racks of molds they just pull the orders and uh, that confuses everyone like how do you know what's what yeah yeah that's taken a long time for people to learn that um but yeah because you got to look at a mold and you got to look in reverse so it's yeah. really right. confusing for people mm -hmm. And, and especially if you haven't used that mold, some of the molds are from Australia right. that I have, and they're 15 years old. Yeah. So you're like, I, oh, I want to, I want to use that on your cage. Yeah. And like, what's it look like now? I forgot. And then uh, you got to look at the mold, not the rent work. end product, yeah. and try and work that out. But yeah. there's there's about three of us: my son and Robert, who's worked for me for 12 years. So um, between the three of us, we can find anything there. Yeah, it, it seems crazy to that's, me, but that's it, helpful. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. and then we've got tom tom tom, tom Hudson, great, who's yeah. making yeah. the aquariums he's been making I love tom. Yeah. glass and acrylic aquariums for, for 30 years yeah tom is like the uh uh he is the like uh, gilligan professor he, exactly he's the professor <laughs> he is he's like a little bit Hello, a little tom. bit like you know uh yeah he's great i mean he he's a genius yep and uh and and i i, I just I, I literally love tom i really really <laughs> do speaking of that do you know gilligan's island do you know gilligan's island I know the name because you guys talk about it. <laughs> oh, we had this conversation earlier about the generation gap. But yeah, yeah I know. Yeah. Like it always comes up. <laughs> it when was you're such talking. a great show. Hey, let me catch up just really quick on some super chat stuff, just because we're gonna go. Uh, Nick Plansky, love you guys. Can't wait for the expansion. Um, uh, can you go back to that for one second? I don't know what that said right there. I'm sorry. They're gonna so come sorry. from. Uh, anyways, yeah, come from it. Anyways, uh, more, <laughs> it's okay. More, money, more money. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and we appreciate it, guys. I mean, obviously, it, it, it means a lot to us. You guys are always are donating. And You're stuff making like me that. dizzy, Jay. Uh, Josh, <laughs> Josh, uh, mail says, uh, wish I didn't have to leave yesterday afternoon. Was amazing to see how everything comes together. Thank you, guys. Mm -hmm. Stuart is a beast. Thanks, the man Josh, never stops. For your help. Thanks for your help, Josh. Seriously, you guys, Thank we had you. a great yeah. people. Uh, Dash, New York, is, <laughs> is Lori that, allowing you to get another the big snake? The answer to that is no, Dash. But well, thank you listen, for your that is some. Gift. I mean, <laughs> we, you next? know, Max Strong was in today. Day and we were talking about we now have an uh -oh. area you and max can talk about anything you well want no so to. max is super chat yeah. is eric thank <laughs> you eric Way thank you, you go, guys there <laughs> you go guys looking forward to seeing the finished project i got uh the perfect name for the two-headed turtle lamangelo and Arlo. <laughs> oh, i like that yeah, yeah that's good that's so good. Stuart, you know the story of this i do not lamangelo and arlangelo or Ar arangelo, arangelo. Yeah. so the, I, you know there, some people say it's an urban legend yeah. some no, people say it's true it's got to be true I don't Does know. It? So what it is is supposedly yeah. someone named their twins Lemangelo and Orangelo, which oh, is yeah. lemon jello, orange jello. But okay. they called them Lemangelo. She had twins Orangelo. and didn't know what to name them, and she looked at her dessert menu, okay. like the menu at the, <laughs> <laughs> the thing, yeah. and there was lemon jello. And she was like, okay. Yeah. So I don't know if it's true or not, but we we went back and forth with this. Uh, a couple went, last I things. went to school with a guy called Ibrahim Ibrahim. So Ibrahim yeah. Ibrahim. Yeah. Ibrahim. Yeah. That's a good so one. The, well, we've talked just... about weird names in the past here on this podcast, actually, yeah. with uh, Noah being wacky. Sorry, Abraham. No, no, no. Uh, <laughs> uh, Jordan Pittman, uh, love your videos and podcasts. Hope to visit one day. Live in France. Can't wait to see the new Reptarium. Mm. I'd love to love come. To you guys you. come. Yeah. We've got to go to France. Um, Bonjour. Yeah, we've got oui, to go oui. and, yes, and visit. Yes, it's on my list. Yeah. <laughs> and then, uh, finally, Sharon. Uh, <laughs> Sharon. Uh, thank banana. you so much. I like Sharon, you, you, she always supports yeah. everything. So thank you guys again for the Super Chats. We will definitely get uh, we'll get some more, and we'll also um, you know answer some questions at the end of the podcast. So anyways, Lori is, uh, you know, well, I saw you, you, you know, so Lori didn't want anyone to seem anything, but you were seeming stuff today. And oh, it's kind of like, oh my yeah. God. Okay. Did you hear the answer no, to that? No, no, no. Okay. What happened here? I did. I went behind. And she, kept, <laughs> and she kept walking past me and looking in and I'm thinking I'm being tested a graded by Lori. <laughs> Lori literally the literally, guy that invented it is being and, and i saw him i'm like okay Stuart's gonna do it that's fine if anybody could do it it's Stuart. and then i looked behind him and i was like he is not hitting any of those screws there's like, 50 screws what, yeah, i put screws like, in literally it literally all along the so whole let, front let's back up for a second so people understand so basically when you have the seams the, the thing is with the polyurea you know you can explain kind of the system of how it goes you know so in this case the anaconda cage because it was so yeah. big it had to come in two pieces yeah so we couldn't overlap the rock from the other so yeah it, and and we had to seam it to the yeah. be waterproof and whatnot yeah. so i wanted to do that laurie wants to do all the rest all yours I, yeah. I, yeah, yeah. I surrender to that anyway so i hopped in on doing it but because um some of it was quite rigid yeah i needed to screw it down onto the m1 yeah so i used about 50 screws yeah and then and they have to come out yeah 
because they're they're not they're not stainless steel screws and what have you. So I'm hopping in and I'm I'm doing the the seaming in between all of the screws. Right. It didn't, and but she did not hit any screw. No, and she so. keeps walking past and and she's not saying anything to me. And I'm like, oh, I think I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that feeling. I see. I'm like, yeah. how can he not see every single one of those screws? <laughs> like, and, and and then you were so consistent. There. You were consistent. Exactly. Consistently yes. missing the screws. And then she sees me taking the screws out and she says oh that's great yeah <laughs> thought you weren't gonna like, leave yeah. them that's what he says oh yeah so all these screws have to come out i'm like oh my god Thank i was god. i was wondering what was going on with that i'm like i gotta jump in that tank because i gotta hit the <laughs> cover yeah all and of basically what happens is you guys are just you guys are just blending blending the seams that's with, with yes. like a silicone and and oh. dust and and uh and so obviously Lori was uh so uh, what's unique bigger. about uh, that and, and the way we're making rocks yeah. is we're not painting them. And, and right. that's not opposed to you using paint sure. to highlight and add some mosses and other things. Sure. Yeah. But just the fact that our rocks are colored with a crushed rock, sands and minerals. Yeah. Um, so when you come to use silicon or M1 and do the joints and you dab, I mean, the trick is to dab the powder onto the yeah. silicon, then you're texturing it and coloring yeah. it at the and same it, time. It, the scene goes it, away, essentially. It disappears yeah. if you do a yeah. good job. Right. If, good job is the important. <laughs> and Stuart obviously <laughs> does a good job because he invented the process. Or right. not invented, but you're, you're pretty yep, good right. at it. You definitely worked well on it. Perfected. Uh, but, no, I did but, invent the process. <laughs> yeah, well, there you go. Well, then you did invent it. There but uh, Lori, uh, obviously, is, She's, you know. She, she enjoys. I mean, she was doing yoga in yeah. the iguana oh, cage oh, for Lord. like eight Eight hours yesterday my foot both of my feet last night were so sore because yeah. you you guys put the big rock in first yeah. Yeah. so i had to like balance so, barefoot mm. on there and like it's rigid like there's all these things yeah. so after you know a half an hour of having your foot like on Twisted. that hard thing yep. oh my god the cramps and the soreness <laughs> like that was part of why i woke up too last night is because like i had a lot of soreness i had to rub yeah that was you the lotion she had to yes. rub the weed, <laughs> the weed lotion. Uh, so yeah so the, oh, i had no so clue because <laughs> last night there was so much noises going on oh, i was just like it was lord me. get me through this the night the demons are awake no, oh, it, shit. it was me and of course the two dogs because uh, they have to be by me so I was downstairs, I know. and then Phoebe was pouncing. I, it was she was making a, a big noise. It was not a good night. I was no. just like the demon. Stuart asked where no. you were yesterday working. Yeah, I was. Like, he's like, what are you video. doing? <laughs> I know. He's like, why isn't no over here? I was. I was making sure that we still have YouTube followers. See? Yeah, I will say it's been it's been tough. Like you know, this tells you how busy I've been. I haven't posted a TikTok video in four days. Wow. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Oh four my days God. without That's TikTok. And, and, and man. TikTok still goes on. No, wow. I mean, the followings are, you know, <laughs> Jay, what's up? I only learned what TikTok <laughs> need, was a few days I know, ago. I know we talked about TikTok, you know. You know what, so do like yourself a favor. Don't, don't, don't even know, no. no. <laughs> well, no but it, it is, I will say it's it's difficult. Like, like I, I think that a couple days before you showed up, like I started becoming so laser focused that I almost like, yeah, it's like, everything from YouTube to Instagram. Mm -hmm. Not that I didn't want to do it. It's just that it was much more of an afterthought. Whereas typically yeah. like, you know, Noah, when you're, you know, social media is yeah. your life. Like everything is kind of like part of your thing. Like, oh, this will be a cool picture. Or this will be a yeah. cool video where I wasn't even opening up my apps for like 12 hours because. See, but that makes me happy. Because yeah. that means you're actually working. Because honestly, it annoys yeah, right. it yeah. does. It annoys me because that's exactly how my mind goes. Like I, I realize that part is work, but to me, it also is not like there's a lot of physical, well, it is our, yeah. there's a lot of physical labor that needed to go on this week. Well, we so did. I was we were, happy. Yeah. I know yeah. you did. Yep. Well, and was, I appreciate it. Also, the other part was there was so many people yeah. that was just like, exactly. No, I, they, no, nobody needed my help. Like, I mean, yeah, shout no, out we're, seriously to job. everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Stuart, he was just throwing, he's like, you, you, you. Yeah. <laughs> but there's <laughs> still standing people yeah. standing around, you know? Yeah, exactly. I because couldn't we get to did. everyone. You're right. We had so yeah. many people, which was yeah. super nice that that many yeah, was people awesome. took time out of their right. their yeah, lives to help yeah. us out yeah but, yeah incredible that's it I'm, I'm gonna see if i can get them to my factory I i've know, got plenty right? of work for them <laughs> Yeah, maybe, I mean, it's maybe you need yeah, to get on the TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's what it takes. <laughs> yeah, if you get the TikTok, man, that's that's a TikTok shout out. Uh, but you know, a real quick, uh, Trailblazer ask again, uh, some genetics questions, explanation videos. You know, those are hard. Um, you have so many of those. Well, videos, it is, it's, and it's really honestly. hard because it's really like so. A lot of people, uh, like, uh, like, you know, when you're talking about genetics 
Stuart with with reptiles gets really crazy right because you've got recessive and incomplete dominant and all kinds okay, of stuff I don't know if Tyler's a guy or a girl but Brian stay out of their dreams uh, stay out of my dreams. Tyler <laughs> says, uh, stay out of my dreams. Can't wait to come out and visit. Uh, hey, I, I hope I'm, you know, wrangling some King Cobras in your dreams or something like that. But, uh, but yeah, so the, <laughs> that's, okay. that's weird. <laughs> <laughs> he took yeah, that okay. to a different All right, level, well, whatever. whatever. <laughs> um, yeah, you're a funny family. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, we, uh, uh, but yeah, we so try. I don't know about snakes, <laughs> genetics, explanations. We, I'd love to do something, but I just don't want it to be. And that's the thing with the vlog now I, i'm always it's always kind of in like you a state what, of flux is, this is what i said though honestly What's that? you have already done all of the genetics well i think that's right sooner right. or later like if that, you look back right. because you've been doing it for so many years you have all of that stuff there this is what happens uh, yeah. okay so you want to make a fast like the video not boring right so you speak really fast that's true and then you're and the genetics involve huge words so yeah. you're like oh people polymorphism freaking blah 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 blah, blah. <laughs> right and then then i'm just like uh, uh, i don't even know what's going yeah. on anymore like no i'm trying and i'm trying really hard to talk slower lately i really am like, yeah, yeah, I, I am but in the trying. last minute yeah yeah just yeah. something like, yeah exactly i'm slowing down but uh but I, what i was gonna say older was, <laughs> what i was gonna say is that uh you know the vlog is it's always evolving and and whereas maybe in the past it was like uh best pet snakes now i kind of feel like it's just kind of whatever we're doing that day you know and i don't yeah. know if that's a good thing or a bad thing yeah. you know i i hope that it's more like okay. kind of our life and you know like obviously there's you know some what? major things going on now but there's so many people in the world and everybody wants something different. You well, know that, what I yeah, mean? You get the people who want the scientific yeah. and the the whatever. Yeah. And then you got the people who literally want the day to day. So really, right. honestly, I think you got to do what you want to do. Yep. Yeah. Well, I think yep. for That's me, it. yeah, for yep. me, I feel like there's, uh, I guess, you know, back in the early snake bites day, we've been doing this for like 13 years. That's what years. I'm saying. If you we, go we back. Did so many, we did yeah. so many videos on, you know, best mm -hmm. snakes, you know, snake genetics. And I kind of feel, uh, but we were the only ones back then. Not the only ones, but very, there was hardly... No. No, we were probably the only one, yeah. you know, but uh, much like you inventing that thing, not that we invented the internet, but, yeah, uh, we did. but yeah, <laughs> us, and, us and Al Gore, but uh, we were certainly one or two snake videos on the internet when we started. Now there are a lot of great content yeah. creators that yep. do great jobs of, of explaining genetics. And yep. I kind of, now I think it's just kind of moved to the next, right. next stage. I think, I think so. Okay. Yeah. I agree. I mean, I don't know. I mean, so anyways, my point is, I know we went on with the, the genetics things. I don't see a genetics video have, coming. I have a question. Maybe. That Who you knows? wouldn't let me ask before. Oh, boy. Yes. I want to hear it. Oh, okay. boy. So, Stuart, coming from Australia. Yep. Okay. I have a question because a lot of people, say, from Europe and stuff like that, I notice that their mentality as far as holiday and stuff like that is mm -hmm. very different from those of the US where we just work our butts off. Now, what do you mean by <laughs> holiday? Do you mean vacation yeah. or you mean, okay, yeah. vacation. They call it holiday. Yeah. Right, yeah, there. that's what I was trying yeah. to get at. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So um, to where, you know, I'm, we just work ourselves to death I'm and do whatever. I'm probably the worst person. Yeah, he works so like, how, as, how, he works no, every day. But how is Australia with that? Is that well, how they're wired too? Well, like more like US or more like Europe? No, more like Europe. In between, okay. Okay. in between. So four weeks a year get holidays oh well that's um, i mean i don't think most people in here. u.s get four no, weeks they holiday don't. They no don't. they don't it's, like you're it's, lucky if you get one or two like two yeah, is probably amazing like 10 days yeah. a year yep yep so, so um okay. that's mandatory that if you employ someone after a year they get four weeks holy cow in australia and, yep and on wow. top of that you no other country does this that you get 17 percent loading added to the, your pay what so is you that? get you get extras so if you earn a thousand dollars for that four weeks, which would be more than that, you would earn another hundred and seventy dollars would get given to you in your pay. Wow. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Wow. Not very good when you're running a business yeah, with right? thirty five yeah. employees. So, and then, you know, <laughs> yeah. and that's my question there because yep. you know, having a business too, like yep. I I appreciate it from the standpoint of whatever, but like does the government help with that? No. Or how no, do they no, expect no, 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 you to no. be able to afford no. that? So you've got like hmm. yeah. You've got 11 public holidays, so four weeks paid to your employee, 11 public holidays, then I think it's eight six day, sick days as well you've got to pay. Interesting. Um, it's, it's yeah. So that's but, 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 but what you have to remember is that 
you know, the cost of living is higher there as well as all your goods oh, are it higher. Is. It is. Like, so, so, you know, the employers are going to have to charge. Someone's paying for that. Right. right. You know what I mean? Like, okay. like, uh, it is true. Yeah. That, like when yeah. we were in Australia, everything was more expensive yeah, everything's there more expensive, than yeah. it is in us. Yep. So, right. that's right. okay. I guess all in all, but I was just curious with that. Oh. Like, cause I always, you know, we, until, you know, we started, you know, back in whatever, meeting people from Europe in the, yeah. ho- you know, and then they're talking about all these holidays, like, oh, a month long yeah. trip. I'm yeah. like, how the heck? Right. Like, that's not how people Even like do paid that maternity here. leave, right? Yeah. I mean, I think yep. that there's like yep. six months or whatever yeah. paid maternity yeah. leave, you know, it's, which is crazy. It's very I was just expensive curious. to employ people. So, but you don't follow their guidelines. Yeah. You're more U.S. where yeah. you just I, work I, yourself I, to I, death. I, I, no, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, no. But I enjoy it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it's you know we we obviously uh, well Lori, you've only been to Australia once, right? With me, right? Yes. Okay, so you've been once. Mm-hmm. Um, I've never you've been. Never been. No, you but haven't. you want to go? Because I know that you probably hear stories of Jade. It's not even you know? that. It's just like. I just do not want to be trapped on a plane that long. It is a very. It's long, just yeah, but then so you're on long. the other side of the world. You yeah. get off the plane and you're like, yeah. It's over. Yeah. I, I'm not, it's it, it. Don't let that. That's the biggest thing I hear Americans yeah. say to yeah. me. Oh, I want to go to Australia one but day. It takes so and long. And I'm like, get there. I've come, I've <laughs> come really here like 15 bad. times. You can yeah. go there once. Yeah. It's really not that bad. I mean, I it's a long trip. It is, but for me, like I don't mind. Like you just do whatever. It won't Sleep, cost you any more. So why don't yeah. you fly to LA? Won't cost you any more. Fly to Hawaii. Yeah. Hop off. And then fly to Fiji. You could do ah. that. Hop Ooh. off. Fiji. Fly to New Zealand. Never been. Never been. Hop off. Jesus. Fly to Australia. <laughs> Jesus. What a holiday. Great. What, what a, a holiday, holiday Noah. Whatever. I know. That's Every this flight one of those right away. places are unique and amazing. Yep. I got to yeah. get uh, some more money before I do that. All right. Well, <laughs> there you go. You're young. That's the thing. You know what? And Jade, our daughter, actually yeah. did that. And it's funny because I, I will give my dad the one thing. He he did tell me that when I was 18 because I'm yep. like, what am I doing with my life? He's like, you need to travel. You do. You change. You need to travel. And I'm like, mm, I don't know, yep. you know, this and that. And I didn't, Um, you know, met Brian mm. and you know, started a family and, and not till later did we travel, yeah. but it wasn't until well, we later did a lot of reptile life. shows. Well, yeah, but <laughs> exa- we exactly. travel a lot. That's we saw my animals travel. From all yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. I saw all the different, uh, yeah. speaking of, the, yeah, <laughs> inside yeah. of the trade yeah. shows. I want to <laughs> go to Japan. <laughs> but Japan's go to fantastic. Japan Probably then, the wrong yeah. time they, you know, to I know, get to I know. that part I'm of the waiting, world right uh, now. Wait until the coronavirus yeah. dies Japan down a little bit. Well, no, there's it's some stuff China. going on. There's a boat now, off of Japan right now that's stuck there listen. with people that have like 180 you know people with corona. You can't, Let's not worry about that. Exactly. Okay. Why? Thank because you. I'm not going You're right the now. corona guy? Listen, Thank I gave up on that. You, you gave up on that. Exactly. Yeah, I don't care anymore. Oh, wow. I'm not getting it. You can't let that hold you back. Anyways. I'm just saying. Go ahead. So I'm going there, and I'm going to get a traditional stick and poke. Oh, tattoo. They Dude, have that would people. be horrible. No, they got that guy yeah, that, that, that comes to Detroit. Yeah, so there's a Detroit tattoo. Yeah, there's a yeah, Detroit. Yeah, but I want to get in Japan. Well, he is like, <laughs> I think, authentic <laughs> Japanese, whatever. Authentic Japanese in Detroit. Yeah. I, could, I could do an Australian one. <laughs> what yeah. is that? What is, I think an Sharpie? Aboriginal? <laughs> Aboriginal ones. That they, yeah. they swell up and they form really big lumps on you. Oh, so oh. is it like the so welts? It's a little bit of fire. And oh. hot iron and oh. stuff. Yeah, be oh, so uh, branding. We could, we could, branding. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Show like you. the body modification yeah. stuff. Oh, hey. yeah. That's I mean, sad. well, if you decide you want that, Stuart's available. Yeah, I've never yeah. done it before. <laughs> I'll give it a go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he is Australian. The un- <laughs> that's that's sharp something. Stick. <laughs> yeah, it's just the Universal Rock logo. Right. <laughs> 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 You're like, wait a second. Yeah. Not- oh. oh, I made the wrong one. I picked up the wrong one. Yeah. Sorry. I picked up the wrong mold. Uh, Sorry. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's oh just a gosh. mold. <laughs> just a mold. So, you know, it was, it was, yeah, I know that uh, Stuart's pretty talented in the sense that we. I went he to him. He could do with, it. Yeah, he, he could, could, do, he could it. do it. He could I do saw it. him work with fire. Anybody is what I'm saying. could do it. Stuart could do it. I saw him work with fire because I came up with, uh, here we are building oh, the Reptarium. And actually, Lori came in that day, and she was real pleased was that we were, happy. instead of working on the reptarium, I was like, Stuart, I got this idea. Can we make a volcano? Oh, yeah. yeah. And, uh, and so, Stuart. Yeah, and you saw it. 
because now yeah. we have like three. Yeah, no two. We have two, two. We, but we haven't finished. We have yet. a mold. We could have a thousand. <laughs> we could have a thousand. <laughs> now I think that. So as a kid, I always wanted to make one of those volcanoes. You know that you put the vinegar and we in. did. I didn't paper mache. Yeah, but I never did. Well, that's your fault. I know. Well, my parents. Yeah. I guess whatever. So exactly. You didn't have me for a while. But but Stuart made an awesome mold of a volcano. Yeah. That's just you know like twelve like, inches tall. Okay. It's a gift. A Let's gift. do yeah. this. <laughs> so I still want to do it. I want us to still do it because I think uh, you know uh, it's usually well, paper mache and it's kind of shitty, this, though. right? That the whole point of making the volcano as a kid out of the paper mache is it's fun building it. it well, is. so I think that this is a thing. You make the volcano out of polyurea rock flat. Now you have the to put it together. Yeah, so now you got to put it together. You got to seam it like like Stuart okay. was talking about earlier. You do a little painting, stuff like that. You can teach him. Yeah, yeah. Lori can be the one on the video teaching. The There's little... going to be so okay. many okay. shitty seams. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Lori knows from all the people that have done the seaming here. <laughs> Trust me, most people can't do it. You could so grade. You could seams. grade the little. You could grade the little right. kids. You know, this, Fail. this is real school. <laughs> you'll ne you'll never amount class, to anything, damn son. It. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> nice nice so i think uh i think it's a good idea of course you do you think mm. this is the, you have a is, lot of this ideas is exactly this That's is where good. i feel i went wrong it is okay healthy. i've let him take his dream of having a zoo yeah from a child it's right we've, we've like made this come real now right. he thinks he can do anything <laughs> it is you and know you it know is what? true no, i can do no, anything he it's, can that's true not, <laughs> it, is, it is not true listen it is not true don't point <laughs> don't, don't, <laughs> it is true because you know what the integral thing is what's that me <laughs> no and but I so not on board so this is what <laughs> I, you're I such think. a worker you i saw you just dabbing away all day all night <laughs> Exactly. Yeah, we went out to dinner I last night. I stayed up all freaking night. I didn't even eat dinner. I just finished that iguana cake. <laughs> that, you just said the wrong thing. I just went. We went out to dinner. Yeah, she said she didn't even eat. And there yeah, was Stuart, I. Oh, Stuart and I went out away. to. Stuart and I went out to dinner after a long day of work yesterday. And, and Lori uh, I, continued. I dropped. Her. I dropped Stuart off at the, the at his hotel, and and I came back, and Lori was still working at the restaurant. I was like, I can't just go home. I got to at least see if she's still there. And there and, I was. And there she was working away. You, you know. You on her? your dream. Did you help her? I helped her uh, go home. <laughs> <laughs> I was literally cleaning up when right. he showed up. Yeah, no, up. it was good. She was almost done. Yeah. So it's you know, someone's my wife's like you too. She's she's and she supports me. And you know what? Thousand percent. That is what helps you be yeah. the yeah. success you are. Is yeah. honestly, I, that's what yeah. I told Noah. That's know. you know what? That's the key. Is you need to find the person that so clicks put, with you yeah. and supports you. So yeah. put you your know? girlfriends to the test, fellas. Absolutely. Well, yeah. You, know you don't you yeah. don't want a lazy partner. I swear. No. In, and that in goes marriage, for guys and any, girls. Anyway, like you, you don't want to attach yourself as a woman yeah. to yep. a lazy man because you ain't yeah. going nowhere either. Yep. Yeah. But yeah. That's, that's, but if you can work together, you it, can achieve you can do anything. Anything. Yep. Yeah. Even a big as That's zoo. what I'm talking about. You can achieve anything, right, Lori. <laughs> anything we could do. I know we can, but I pick and choose. Mm -hmm. yeah, Lori's kind of got the kibosh. That's exactly. So we're we're working on well no, I'm not gonna say what we're what I'm working on, but I was working on another we're working project. On the extension to the yeah. zoo for the yeah, last three, three days. Yeah, and yeah, but uh, I'm working on something no. new no, and not. uh Lori <laughs> said no to it. She said I, I she's done. Yeah. She doesn't want to seem anymore. No, no this isn't <laughs> seeming though. This is nothing. I can't say that now. <laughs> no, no, you can't. This no, has I nothing can't. to do with it. Nothing no. to do with seeming. So uh, real quick, uh, Tom Murphy, just just because, 10 bucks. Thank you so much, Tom. I really Thanks, appreciate Tom. you. Everyone else in the thing, thank you so much. Christine, thank you again. Any plans to coming back up to Nerd? I yeah, would like to. Yeah, I want Lori I to come up to Nerd too. I have not been up to that facility. Me Next yeah, time, we I'm going go. too. Yeah, yeah, we'll all go. And Christine, you can come up and hang out with us too. Uh, Is because she from that's, there? Uh, yeah, she's from this, the, that New England area. Okay. I'm not exactly where I know it's not far from Nerd. As a matter of fact, Kevin from Nerd is actually coming uh, here in a couple weeks. So that's going to be really cool. He wants to do a zoo at, up in New Hampshire. I really want him to do it because he is one of the most passionate reptile people I've ever met. Super smart. He's cool, but and, and, he's not going to do it as good as us. No. You know why? <laughs> Maybe I might help you. You know why? Because Kevin doesn't have a me. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. That is true. Stuart's going to come in. He's going to do what he does. He's going to leave. And, and a year gonna, later, it's going to yeah, be the same. Stuart's going to leave all yeah, the yeah. screws. <laughs> and they're <laughs> yeah, all the screws are going to be showing on the entire They're all rusting. Right? <laughs> they, they might all rust and leave beautiful stain marks. Yeah. That makes them yeah. colder. Or, so it might be a better touch. Or not. <laughs> 
but I would, I would, I would love to see uh, Kevin do that. So we we are definitely going to go back up to uh, Nerd at some point. We can all go yeah. together and That's have some fun. It's a hell of a city, Nerd. Well, it's actually it's New England Reptile Distributors, oh. and it's yeah. a, it's actually in a place called uh, Playstow, uh, New Hampshire, by New Hampshire. New, Nashua. Yep. So uh, really cool place, about forty five minutes north of Boston. Okay. And uh, beautiful area, really cool place. Got a ton of really cool animals. So uh, that's where I got to play with the 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 uh, leucistic pure white yeah. king cobra. Wow. That wanted to, her, wow. her name is Lilith, and she wanted to kill me. You know. So yeah. uh, your boy, uh, the jewelry guy, a dog. I showed up late. What's up, everybody? Uh, what's up, dude, man? Thank you guys How you so doing, much. Mike? Uh, CS Productions, Laurie is a true boss of BHP. <laughs> well, everyone knows that. I yes. mean, anyone that anyone that uh, spends any time with us knows who the boss is, number one. Mm -hmm. yep. It's the boss. And, and you can ask the, the employees who the boss is, too, my crew. Well, yeah. the thing is, is you're Mr. Idea Man and yeah. creative, and you're just all over the place. Somebody has to, like, I'm not a good manager. And, and make it work. Yep. I'm yeah. not a good manager you at know. all, you know? Yeah. Like, so the, the thing is, is this yeah. is, this is how you can tell my <laughs> management style. It's like, let's say my crew, which are great, by the way, fantastic yep. people. Um, I walk in and they're all like sitting around chatting. <laughs> you join. Right? Yeah, I join. <laughs> right. Lori That's... walks in and they scatter. Yeah. <laughs> you know, so. I, I always say, you know, if you stop the, as the boss and you want to stop to all the, stop and talk to all your employees, yeah. they'll do that till yeah, totally. finish of the day yeah. exactly yeah. so you can't do that so i'm trying to teach my yeah. children who are yeah. taking over the business you can't do that you gotta you gotta yeah no uh -oh. noah spends more time chatting with eric than he um, does working maybe you could send noah to universal mm. rocks we could do a yeah. bit of a boot camp oh, oh my man. god yes Shit. i like that <laughs> idea no i'm telling all you all right let's line that up Stuart. Yeah. Uh, I can make a shape. <laughs> <laughs> I got work to do, guys. <laughs> I can promise That's you. That's right. At Universal Rock. No. <laughs> I can promise you that when you go there, you will be very dirty. Dirty. Like, very I dirty. don't know sure. if people see our hands, but like, this hey, mine, is mine, going. Mine are good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You I know. You're, I scrubbed them for 20 and, minutes. And yeah. you're, you're a glove guy. I can't do it with the gloves because the gloves get in the way for me. So, this is my life. Like, and, honestly, yeah. I, I thought of this today. I'm gonna go to Mexico looking like no. That. no the oh ocean, gosh. the ocean water will clean that in a day. Ah, yeah, look at that. Get in the so now every time we Good do an expansion, we got to go to the ocean, it spend will. some time. So uh, you know, it's, it's, uh, Jay, I don't know if we have any pictures or anything that we can pull up of of Stuart or any video. I, I'm putting you on the spot here, but of Stuart in his gear. You know what I mean? With like white, he's got the goggles the mask, on, he's got the, the mask. Whole thing. But see, I always tell Lori, and I might be completely wrong about this, about you. So wait, I, wait, I'm wait, 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 wait. Go up wait, to go. that moose. What, what, was, was, what was that moose? Oh, this thing is so cool, <laughs> man. This is styrofoam, right? Yeah, it is. It is. And it's coated with our rock material, but it do, it's not done with any coloring. Yeah, not in the reptilian. So that's well, Sean. Yeah. Sean does that and makes that. So that's another division <laughs> to Universal Rocks that. If anyone wants some signs or crazy animals or well, anything. Well, I told you about so the cool. snake up the pole, the yep. pole sign. Yeah. You know, I want to do that. And that's what it would look like, Lori, is that, oh, that pole. So, so is that the foam stuff? Yep. There's another gorilla oh. right look at up the gorilla. there. Yeah, the gorilla I, I didn't make there. that. My friend David Joff in Australia oh has got molds for <laughs> 2,000 animals. That, that is that, crazy. He's eight foot tall. Eight foot tall and you can well, sit the gorilla on his... doesn't fit. we got to stick with the snake. Well, so anyways... My point was, no. is that um, there's no steward in a white suit. Yeah, no, it's a, yeah, probably no one. <laughs> oh, yeah, look, no, go back, go back down a little bit. Go back down, go back. See this rock on the left? Okay, that's one of that's a rock eight. Okay, that rock, rock eight. That that rock I made twenty years ago, and it and my friend in Australia, Russell, sent a photo of that, and that will so. Universal Rocks, 15 years later, that is. Oh. So, but that's probably 17 now. So it's got all the moss and that, And it, it grew all the lichen on, oh, on it. So that's, so that's one of our, real that's moss. One of you our, didn't do I that. I did not do that. Oh. I wish I could do that. Yeah. That, that I could, was impressed. That <laughs> I thought you did do that. Oh, I, was like, I should have told you. <laughs> yeah. So when, when Wait, I... Wait, can we go back? Yeah, go ahead. Go, go ahead. back to the other... Yeah. Let's see Sexy Stuart with the rock. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Look, that's... <laughs> That's Stuart. that's the calendar from showed, 2019 right his there. Leg there. Those, <laughs> chick, those chicken legs. Yep, that's it. That's Stuart. All right, that's all I want to Stuart do. Warm, I, I like. Wait, out. wait. Go back to that Jay for one second for me. I like this Johnny uh, Maserati daddy. I like that comment. <laughs> <laughs> What's up with that? <laughs> I like that comment. Good day, right Johnny. There. How you doing, buddy? Uh, so, uh, but I always envision the fact that, like, uh, you dress up in, the, you're in this white thing. You got the I respirator. Don't dress but it's, up. No, I you wear go, oh, there it. it is. Right there, right there. There you go. Yeah, the protective so, white suits, which so make it, total sense. I always say that, you know, yeah. 
this this is my vision of you seeming happy. Like it always seems oh, like you're, you're happy like you're that. You're creating. You know? Well, yeah. you're creating. And and if you walk anywhere near that spray booth without wearing that, in your clothes will be ruined in yeah. ten seconds. Yeah. So you have to do that. But but while you're in that, I mean, we're creating. That's a that's from a year ago, and that's a tree for the MGM as well. Wow. And it's it it was thirty feet, no, twenty six feet tall, and that's nice. the tree trunk of it. So nice. we're in the middle of creating an amazing tree that's going yeah. to be seen yeah. by thousands of people. Yeah, what a great job. How yeah. cool is that? Like, well, I think I, it doesn't like matter. It, and I appreciate it. Well, yeah, and it's just cool when you find something that is, like you said, yep. that's so passionate. Well, no matter what that is. For me, it's animals. You know, for yeah. me, when I see somebody see my animals in, in the same enjoyment that you see someone seeing your your rock or your yeah. tree or whatever the case is. And that, that's what I said to you as soon as I walked in um, the other day when you when you got yeah. me from the airport i walked in and i did one lap around oh and yeah because we were open and you yeah. were open and mm -hmm. everyone and here's here's people picking up snakes they've never picked up before yeah. Yeah. and they're not just picking up a little snake it's a massive thing yeah. wrapped around yeah. their yeah. neck and then other people's pick other people picking up lizards yeah and I'm like, this is fantastic. Yeah. Like, yeah. really, yeah. you're giving people an it, experience. It is. Mm -hmm. It is yep. the same thing. Because even though, like, my passion is not reptiles like yours right. is, yeah. but I appreciate that every weekend that I work, just like you said. Because right. the impact we're making on people, yeah. like, right. every single day that we're open, yep. people leaving are like, this was so awesome. Right. I love true. this. You know, yeah. whether they came in scared or whether they yeah. came in loving it. Either yeah. way, like they leave like this was an amazing experience. Yeah, I've I've, I've been to many that. many and many zoos. That. I've been to many zoos, and you can't they're get not that doing if you're that. not hands on. No, like looking through a glass is. Like, oh, that's cool. But yeah, to yeah. actually get it beyond the glass is an experience you it's can't special. mimic. Okay. Yeah. Very special. You know, and I love that we can do that, you yep. know, for sure. Yep. <laughs> Apparently, there's some naughtiness going on in this in the chat room, okay. some, like, bots and stuff like that. So we Clean do apologize. Clean that shit up, Jay. Yeah, we don't need that. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, we, we, <laughs> that's the downside of being public, you know. I mean, when you yeah. do something live, you're, there's going to be idiots and stuff like that. So it's I like apologize like a streaker that. on the cricket team or something yeah, no, exactly I, yeah. a streaker on the cricket team damn it bots <laughs> <laughs> no i think it's just like you know like click on this for you know that yeah. type of thing uh -huh. you know stupid okay. bots but anyways don't it, click it, the was, link was he, yeah, right. do not click the link whatever you do <laughs> was he australian uh, probably, <laughs> yeah, probably yeah. click it <laughs> click it <laughs> yeah. you know interestingly enough uh Stuart, I met you uh, the, for the first time. We met you at an, a reptile yep. show, yep. interestingly enough. The NARBC that, weirdly enough, is going on this coming weekend. I don't yes, know if you knew that. I did. Are what? you guys going? Or no, no you no. don't do it anymore. Dude. Yeah, so Stuart used to set used uh, to set up uh, like a bunch of cool cages. I remember like the round cages you had. All round kind of, nature. Yeah. Everyone can have a look at that. Round nature. That's, yeah, round that's nature. unbelievably attractive yeah. terrariums really cool and aquariums. Terrariums, yeah. Yep. Yeah, I always say that they're very unique, you know, yes. because you don't normally see round cages, you know, and, and they're kind of cool. Right. And But you had a lot of cool stuff back then, and um, that's when I first met you. But I still didn't understand the the, the nature of what you did. Yes. You know what I mean? I saw this little window into what you did. And I remember when I first came to your factory, uh, or whatever you call it, uh, I don't know. Whatever what you, you call your place I don't of know, business. Yeah, yeah. I, I think of it as a factory, what, but What do you call it? That is a factory. Okay. okay. Uh, yeah. um, I was blown away. And, and I remember walking into like this first area, which was is now being redone, by the way. Yep. Uh, it used yep. to be really like waterfalls and pools. Now you're doing hot tubs. Hot, tub, hot tubs is... You know what? I've really I, I've got one at home. Jay, do we have hot tub to pull up? We oh, can pull, up, pull here? That up Can we pull up hot tub time machine? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I can't do I can't do that oh, wait. yet. Probably not. I, no, we can't do that. But um, the, so let's see if down we can the get left. It. I went, saw it. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. So the hot tub. Believe tubs, me, that's all Brian can talk about. I and love that's these hot tubs. What we need There's in one life. on the right. So yeah, that, here we go. That's, a, that's an above ground one, but that's. Um, we need that's more. about 12 feet right. long. That's I mean, anything's better than the shit thing that we have in yeah, our yard right now. Sick. The plant holder, okay, non-holding water. Find, hot the, tub find the other one. Go back and go down. So the hot tubs. So I actually didn't realize till I was sitting in our one at home. No, not yet. Sorry. That, that, that one? Were you there, doing? next yeah, one. Yeah, the yeah. bottom left here. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. So sitting in that. So here so I am. So this is in your backyard. This is in my backyard. Okay. With the waterfall. So that, that seats eight to ten people. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. It 
four people can pick it up. So you dig a hole, put it in, and you've got to hook it up to all the equipment we supply, which is gas heaters or electric heaters and timers. Right. Remote. You can control everything from your phone. Wow. But this is like everyone else sells hot tubs that sit on the ground, on yeah. the surface of mm -hmm. the ground, or you get in a pool guy to build you one when he's building the pool. Yeah, which costs quite a ton expensive, of money. Yeah. Quite expensive. You know these, what? these aren't cheap, <clears throat> but when you're sitting in, you're immersed in, in yeah. nature. Yeah. Like I know our rocks aren't exactly real, but it feels like yeah. it. Yeah. So, I'm well, I mean, seeing, that looks amazing. I'm, yeah, I'm seeing that uh, our pond is changing. And instead of our pond, yeah, instead of the pond, gonna we're gonna do the that. hot tub. Yeah, we F should do the that. Pond, <laughs> the we're getting yeah. a hot yes. tub with a waterfall. I'm all in on that. <laughs> we'll actually use it for once. I know, right? Instead of the dogs yeah. jumping at it, we get to use it. I'm in for that idea. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm all about the hot tubs. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's pretty beautiful. It's pretty good. And, and oh, Jay, can great. you pull that Instagram back up? If you go up a little bit, I want to. I want to look at this office. I th th so. Another thing yeah, we've been talking yeah, about is like yeah. man caves and yes, stuff right, right yeah. there to if the left. If anybody is getting that office, it's me because that my office, office is, is nice. Yours is a yeah. shit show. Yeah. Well, yeah. anyways, too, you can kind of see on the left, but on the better inside, than his. on the left, you see the rock wall, but I, if that's on the inside. It's a, a rock and the, the ceiling's rock. Is and, it a video? Can we play it? It is a video. Oh, yeah. Let's play that shit. <laughs> This was really cool. Progress Take a look on the man cave. The young Davids and Max Office. have been building this, but yeah. have a look at this. This is amazing, man. Yeah. Number one, the door is the door. super cool. Okay. I can lock everybody out. There's a still vaulted door. door. They could lock you in, too. Yeah. Yeah. That's, That's fine, just came too. In. <laughs> okay, so look above. It's it's oh, gosh, look at that. Here, That's here, like, here. It's just amazing. This door and that one. <laughs> Get, what are you, why is he not what going are you doing, there? man? Come you can on. start to see Show the ceiling. <laughs> so you can see you a little know, bit of the ceiling, but it's like the total man up. cave. It's going to show you in a minute. Or, right. or, right. or woman cave. You really? She yeah. sheds, they call them. I yeah. don't know. Uh, I don't want those stupid sheds. Oh, there's, the, <laughs> there's the ceiling. I mean, she shed. Look at, I mean, it's like literally, if you're going to do a man cave, that is a cave. Yeah. You know, I mean, it's, that's I cool. mean, with the spotlights and. And, that, mean, and that's like just hours of putting together. Yeah. Not days. Yeah, not days. Not, yeah. yeah. And no, how that else was you, very cool. You couldn't even do it any other way unless you lived in a mountain and you cut into the mountain. Right. So. Right. Minecraft. No, so, and I just love everything about exactly. that. I think you know there's what? so much opportunity. Noah. Noah. Minecraft. Minecraft. Yeah. <laughs> he is really good at Minecraft. He did this shit for years when he was a kid. Yeah. Again, another reason to go to Universal yeah. Rock because it's rock. But <laughs> um, real quick, let's get a couple super chats just in, it, so I can catch up on you guys. And I appreciate everyone in the, in the chat room uh, yeah. and stuff like that. You guys are amazing. I, I, I always, by the way, I don't know if you guys do this, but I always like watch the vlog back just to see the chat room afterwards. It's, I, I think it's pretty, these guys are amazing. Anyways, um, <laughs> I'm all over the place. Hey, either. I'm tired. I haven't slept in days. All right. Just mm. hang out. Shout out to Jay. Hey, Jay. A uh, shout out to Jay for kicking the butt behind the scenes. That is true, Jay. Thank you, Thank Jay. you so much. Jay, seriously. Jay, I, I told you, Jay. Lehman, can Brian get a sloth? No, the answer is no. Next. We will get a sloth. No, we have plenty. No, we, yeah, we will, will get a sloth. Next. We'll get a sloth. It's not even a matter of we have, if. We have it's a matter six of when. Right now. Uh, yeah. Dash New York, uh, would you be able to do, uh, I can't read. Uh, would Where you it be looks able to... like a home movie theater, but looks like a cave. Oh my gosh, yeah, you Absolutely. could totally do that, right? You like do a home movie theater that looks like a cave. It would be the best on the internet. It. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Could you imagine? I didn't idea. even think about That's that. Nice. That's Stephanie again. We should uh, cave gosh, this. Stephanie is amazing. The podcast. Let's make it a cave. Actually, that's not a bad idea. That's the not podcast. a bad idea. Let's Stuart. make it a cave. We could make a. Really Let me know in the chat if you guys. Yeah. I'll help for that. Yeah. Uh, there you go. I'll he could that. learn. See? Right, so there you let go. us know, uh, Stephanie. Can I That'd can I get cool. back to that, Stephanie? Thank you she again. She was asking the cleaning uh, solutions. The cleaning yes, solution. they are safe. Yeah, they're safe for them. Yep. There's a couple options uh, that you can use. You can use like F10. You can use a uh, quatricide. Um, like we with the windows, we're using like a vinegar and water. Uh, there's also Fritz is actually sending us some new mm. stuff as well for cleaning windows that I'm are safe for animals. I'm seeing this request for Lori and the ladies of the Reptarium podcast night. It's I really like idea. that idea. It's a good idea. Seriously, and yeah, it gives let's us put a night that on off, the right, agenda. Jay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, well, Jay. not Jay. <laughs> Jay's gotta, Jay's, poor Jay's got to do that. Yeah. Yeah. Right, but yeah. you. Jay works another night. Right. We're going to put that on like, Monday. Great, right? <laughs> Jay. Monday night, ladies You've got of nothing the to do. You've got nothing to do. So, uh, so Stuart, I, I, I want a sloth really bad. Like I, I don't sell sloths. Guess swaths. what? No, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. You know what, Stuart? I want a lot of things too, but some of them aren't going to happen. I, like I just sloth. make rocks, mate. What are you talking about? <laughs> exactly. what are you talking but you me can for? make me well, an awesome know, sloth display. I could, make, I could make you a 10-foot-high sloth. See? 
Well, not the sloth. I don't want a oh. sloth. I don't want you to make me a sloth. I want you to make me a sloth enclosure. Yeah, make the sloth. Oh, could, that's it. Just make the sloth. <laughs> <laughs> no. You don't have to feed him. No, exactly. Yeah, the but best I want kind a sloth. Of sloth. And right? they w- and it'll move exactly the same. What's amount. interesting is that <laughs> there was someone. Um, <laughs> there was someone that clickbaited me on your podcast. He said that he had a sloth, a seven month oh. old that he wanted <laughs> that to donate. That wasn't real. <laughs> well, he never contacted I love me. You. I was Whoever pretty sure. you are, that's awesome. I was pretty sure it was not real, I but I was hopeful. I was hopeful. No. No. Uh, you know, I mean, you can always hope. <laughs> what can you but uh, unfortunately, he never contacted us, so that was a, it was. A, it, we could make an heart. amazing because tree for the sloth, and that's all you need, right? You don't you even need what? a cage. You I just need, need a tree. You don't like sloth. me anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know what? You're riding a fine line. I'm going to take the rest of that beer away. <laughs> Three, two, one. <laughs> he's got all. <laughs> <laughs> I will jump across the table. <laughs> so what's next, Lori? I mean, uh, we're you know we've got what's uh, next is a lot of seeming. Oh, you a lot have of, a lot. A lot of I ways. would have. I, the, <laughs> that's, that was, like, that's, that was, yeah, you got to be careful how you say that because that sounded a little bit like semen. Seeming? Oh, 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 God. I don't know. You You're disgusting. Careful. No, no, no. I'm just saying. I wasn't discussing, but I was saying you got to be careful. No, I said seeming. Seeming. Yeah. I must be off today. I exactly. didn't catch that. Exactly. You know what? Noah would just normally him. always catch you know that. Why? I'm just so tired. He ain't done no seams. Why are you so tired? What, is, what, what have you been doing that's made you so tired? I slept too much. <laughs> <laughs> All right, no, I was wondering about that. You, you must a, send him down to university. Do uh, by the way, Dan Put is in the chat room. Dan, what's up, hey, brother? Dan? No, do you I have don't. any questions? Oh, come, Dan, tomorrow. You got to come. No. You got to help my leak. Nice meeting you, Dan. Yeah, you got, Dan, we've got leaks. We, we got need leaks. Help. We need you bad, we need Dan. You. Very <laughs> easily fixed, Dan. Don't worry about it. Okay, yeah. Stuart's always very zen. And I do want to talk about zen. I want to finish your, your, your thing, and I want to talk about zen a little bit. Ted Guru? Said Guru. Oh, everyone oh, must yeah. look up Said Guru. Let's listen yeah. to that. I don't know what you're talking about, so go ahead. No, so we do. talked about Said Guru, made fun of me the yeah. other day about Said oh, Guru. He guy? didn't just oh, He's make... not weird. <laughs> he's not weird. It wasn't Who's just... Who's going to jump across the table now? <laughs> she was talking a lot of crap about your she, guy. She probably hasn't even looked at it. No. No, he, she did. We saw a picture. She was talking crap. He's the real deal. She beat him up. He's the real... So I love it. Uh, you know, you love. You know what? You're such a. I a, follow. I follow. Like, <laughs> listen. A, I follow. Like, he's a bandwagon. I know exactly. Like, oh, hey, if I'm on the bandwagon to no, something good, are. then I'm on the bandwagon. That's yeah. all right. I'm okay yeah. with I'm that. Forward, it was mate. just like yeah. when you were trying to become a Buddhist, the like couple years ago. Yeah, because he's got a calling. Yeah. See, mm. there he you needs go. to relax. Yeah. I do need to relax. He I really do. Needs to relax, just, but how's that working for you? Well, it's practice. It's practice, right? Yeah, it's practice. Yeah, I'm and I'm you. working. I'm You're working. On, I've been meditating. It's been working yeah. better. You got a when? busy life. When gotta, at night and in the morning, I meditate. Yeah. Mm. Especially in the middle of the night when I can't sleep. You know, then I really do meditate. But and anyway, meditate. said Guru is uh, tell. <laughs> I don't know what 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 is he exactly like. What would be his title? Like what is he? Um, well, Sadhguru, I think, and I'm not Indian by any stretch of the imagination, but it, it, Sadhguru really? is a common name for for a type of enlightened or mystic person i suppose right. and thanks sorry to you indian people out there but yeah. he's such an example he's yeah. he, you can watch him on youtube and he'll talk about yeah. any question anywhere <laughs> anytime and his response is unbelievable and yeah. and it's all about you know you you're busy you guys are busy you know yeah. if we're busy and yeah. we're stressed how do we how do we handle it yeah what's the practice so said breathing guru, guru s-a-d-h he has the inches. I, I think but, it's know, amazing. Just because he's on YouTube, because Bad Choice Noah's on YouTube. I am. <laughs> Don't and listen to Bad Choice like, Noah. Hey, bad Choice Noah, how can I deal with my stress? No, I think Maybe easy. Listen, <laughs> I, I, I punch lo- something. <laughs> See, <laughs> so originally I, I am with <laughs> yeah. Bad Choice yeah. Noah because that sounds very. So originally, another way. <laughs> <laughs> originally, when when you first told me That's about him boy. a year and a half or so ago, <laughs> I mean, I, I went on YouTube and I watched a bunch of his stuff, but a lot of his stuff was like you know, fifteen minutes a half hour hour now i follow him on tiktok and it's like 60 seconds See, oh. yeah and and now i get a lot so guru was on tiktok good god everyone's like, on come TikTok. On. i'm everyone's not on, on TikTok. tiktok i know but i am not on the tiktok it's like two out <laughs> yeah. of the seven billion people on earth have a tiktok see that's a lot. I just That's, made that up. It's pro- I think there's like eight. Well, I think you're right. I think there's almost a billion people on TikTok right. now, like Isn't 800 and something million yeah. or something like that. It's almost crazy. a billion. But uh, I like it just because, and it says it's a, he's a yogi. He's a wonderful yogi. Yeah, so there you go. So people know about it. 
Well, I, I, I love how passionate he is about. It's just for real. That's for yeah. real. I you like it. That is, I mean, that's Wonderful awesome. Wonderful yogi. Mm. Exactly. I dare you all out there to look him up. <laughs> Seriously, if you Do just it. if you just Do listen it. to this guy with the, with an open mind, it is really true. You know, I mean, he, he does, he's not like a a, a salesman. Actually, or something like here that. I got a funny story. At the age of five, six, seven, eight, nine. He was making more money than all the adults in the area oh, catching right. snakes. Catching snakes. He started as a snake catcher. You're right. And, and he talks in, in all in Indian temp, Eastern temples, there's snakes everywhere, always. Right. So there's something very, very mystical about that. And he goes into detail about that. Yeah. But he would, he had 20 snakes in his room that would yeah. sleep. He had cobras. Mm -hmm. He had, when he would meditate, this is going to blow a lot of people away. <laughs> when he's in the middle of the jungle meditating when he was younger, yeah, he would w open his eyes after hours of meditation and there was 20 snakes that had come from the jungle. Well, Brian, and maybe sitting you just around. need to he's start like fucking, meditating. He's like the fucking and, Pied Piper, and man. Exactly. <laughs> and no. then just bring snakes to the reptarium. <laughs> he's, <yeah>. he's <laughs> we would have to buy a lot less. He's Snow Ooh. White. <laughs> he goes out in the jungle yeah, and just exactly. starts singing. He's definitely a Disney princess. <laughs> That's crazy. Can, can, we, <laughs> can we block them out? I like, know. We're having an adult out? conversation. They, I didn't know it was like this. We're the best <laughs> part of this podcast. <laughs> I didn't <laughs> sign up for this. He sits down. <laughs> There's just a circle of cobras oh around him, just listening to what he has to say. Yeah. I will say that um, that's cool. Else the, Indi <laughs> the Indian, the Indian uh, snake catchers are known for being the best in the world, though. A hundred percent, the best in the world. I mean, they're you know literally, like you oh. said, they're taught from infant to catch snakes all the way through the life and they are well, probably absolutely makes amazing sense from safety standpoint from where they live and what goes yeah. on i saw I the craziest assume. video on uh instagram or tiktok probably tiktok shout out tiktok <laughs> shout out tiktok uh, <laughs> of, same thing yeah these indian guys catching a cobra a king cobra it was huge yeah. probably like i don't know eight feet long you know it yeah, might be more yeah and uh and yeah. they <laughs> <laughs> and they were they were doing this crazy like sneak attack method because the snake was trying to get away or something, but uh -huh. they were like running the circles around it and they kept like touching its butt and then they would whip around at him. Yeah. But then the other guy would tap it from behind yeah. until they managed to get a so, good hold on it. So it's like from finding finding Nemo, where you touch the butt and that's what keeps coming <laughs> <laughs> yeah, She's <laughs> She's on a roll today. I know. I don't know what's in there. You're not even <laughs> drinking. It's only stayed a little bit. I've gone through two beers and I don't even drink. I think Lori. Well, I just keep filling the glass. Yeah, she just keeps yeah, filling, keep filling it up. Yeah. Is that what you've been doing? Right it's almost gone. It's almost gone, yeah. So Lori doesn't drink often, but she drinks on podcast nights because yeah, everyone I likes do. a wine Lori better yeah. than us. Nice, uh, nice. But uh, yeah, it's, yeah okay. so there you go. Said you were good, though. But it was cool, though. All right, guys. So touch the butt. That's what you take. Out of this <laughs> no, I mean, you know, we're. Tra I don't know. I don't know what <laughs> the train is off its tracks. Yeah, I mean, what are you so, gonna do with that? What's the next topic? That that <laughs> was it. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> this is bad. Yeah, no, you guys are messed up. He, so Stuart, so let's get here, this back into the adult drink, realm here. Drink some water. <laughs> I'm good. What's one of the crazy projects you've been on? I mean, tell me. I mean, you, you've you've built so many crazy things. You know, I mean. What, well, the what? the main part of my business was always ponds and waterfalls okay. for, for landscaping. Yeah. But on the side of that was always the the reptile and the aquarium stuff. Just be, right. And it works really well because. In America, your weather, your seasons are a lot yeah. more dramatic than Australia, as you right, know. Right, sure. So in winter, all of our ponds and waterfalls just come to a big grinding halt. Right. But gardens, um, aquariums, and reptiles, everyone goes inside, so then yeah. that starts to get busier. So, yeah. so uh, rather than I didn't chase after the big MGM casinos and that yeah. sort of thing. There was already lots of people doing that. Yeah. But what there wasn't was lots of people supplying to the happy homeowners waterfalls ponds right. reptile enclosures right. reptile products aquarium products so that's that's sort of what i did because i can spend all my creativity making a mold yeah and now we can make that a thousand times right whereas if it's like coming here to it no nah, not quite because we we'd already pre-made most of it yeah but like that big tree that we just showed yeah well that tree that requires a lot of my effort yeah. Whereas pulling a mold from the shelf doesn't. So right. So 
uh, haven't done, you know, there's a lot of people done a lot more big jobs than us, but I've sold to a lot more people maybe than those sorts of people. Right, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're more production side yeah. as well and as one-off. And the, so. materials, the material suits that because it yeah. dries in like five, six seconds. Right. So you can spray something that maybe takes 10 minutes. It's completely dry. Right. And now, and now you can use that mold again, whereas fiberglass and cement and poly yeah it takes forever. Yeah. yeah. So you, it's a completely different manufacturing system. Yeah. I just always think of, uh, you know, again, I think every time I'm there, I'm thinking like, oh, you could do this. Like, I think like that's the movie. The yeah, that's the problem, right? <clears throat> of course you are. Yeah, but I'm thinking like the movies, you know, movies, like yep. you know, all the sets, you know, that they're you know they're building rocks, you're, you know. You're you're not on the movies. You don't work for the movies. I don't no, work, not yet, not yet, but not, I'm working on yet? that. No, yeah. I'm just kidding. Is that the next move? My, my one of my good, <laughs> I'm going to go catch snakes on set is what it is. Yeah, I actually have friends in that India? do that. No, no, <laughs> I have p friends that do that on sets in Hollywood. They get paid like 500 bucks a day to just sit there and wait if any snakes if come on set. Snake. Yeah, then, then they remove what? it. You're kidding really? me. Oh, that's, that's, a a that's, that's a job. That's a job. That's a job. That's a job. I believe it. There's you should yeah. tell Anthony about that. There's a that job <laughs> for everything. Well, if you think about it, all right, you've got all these A-list celebrities. They're on site in that are in, terrified of snakes. Not there. It's not. They may not even be terrified of snakes, this, but they can't get bit while they're in the middle of filming. This is what we have I've to never do. Never heard that before in my life. Okay. Yeah, we look that up, Jay. Can you I look think, up like this uh, is what we have like, to do. like rattlesnake film catcher or some yeah. shit? Yeah. Yeah. Rattlesnake <laughs> film catcher. Well, I don't know. Jay, look so, that up. No. <laughs> so Jules Sylvester is one Pretty of sure them. Pretty sure that's not a thing. <laughs> Listen, this is, we need to get this. We need to make this job better. Okay. Yeah. So this is what we need to do. These people are going to get paid more now because of us. Yeah. We're going to sneak around sets and, and just we're gonna, put snakes. See, look, yeah. Here we go. Snakes. Here we go. Look at this. The rattlesnake, the rattlesnake wrangler. wrangler. He literally wrangler. works on sets, clearing and supervise outdoor sets. Good for you, rattlesnake wrangler. This is what this guy does, man. Yeah, he's got a he's got a hotmail. <laughs> hotmail. He's got a hotmail. So he's account. legit. Yeah, he's legit. <laughs> no, but my buddy Jules Sylvester, who is legit, actually does do that. Uh, he's been he's Jules used to have a show on Discovery oh. Channel years ago, so. Uh, that's what he does for a living. Hey, y'all, mm -hmm. Tiffany. And you know, nice uh, to see you know you. who else is? Remember Warren <laughs> Klein from uh, Africa? Warren Klein. Yes. And Nicole, they yeah. helped us on Brian the They're Wild the documentary. House people, right? Right, exactly. Yeah. Uh, that's he actually used to make pretty good money, uh, and and his job was to stay in the oil fields of Angola, and just remove snakes. Oh. From and the oil fields. the Angolan okay. pythons. No, not the oh, Angolan no. pythons. That would be great, though. But no, whenever <laughs> there were monitor lizards or rattlesnakes, like spitting cobras and stuff like that, mm -hmm. they would call him. And he had to, for one month, he would have to stay on site. And then he would have a month off. So a month on, month I off mean, or something like what, that. I mean, I tell you what, if you're a reptile person, that's a great gig. Right? It is a great gig. And yeah. he loved it because he loved the animals. Right. So he would just, I mean, unfortunately, Angola is not a but very nice funny, place. You know, I guess that's just like anything. Like if, if you, you know, have a passion, you can find did a I, job. Did I see you with spitting po cobras once? Yeah. Of yeah, course yeah, you yeah, did. That yeah. scares me. Of course you did. <laughs> it's you <Brian>. know, <laughs> I like everything. I like cobras uh, and spitting cobras are really cool. I think what uh, the the last video we did with spitting cobras <laughs> was actually cool. rank rankles, uh, which are, are not well. They do spit pretty good, but we've also been in Africa for like Mozambique spitters and stuff like that. And those ones are really I mean they'll spit far. How far? How far? Uh, Mozambique can do you know five six foot, pretty accurately too. We actually took a, a piece of plexiglass to show how close it would hit wow. me in the eyes. And from, you know, five feet away, the entire eyes were covered with, with venom. In multiple, can I they, mean, can they, a lot. Yeah, I was going to ask, yeah, I mean, can they do it just once? or they Oh, do no, this one spit probably at least eight or nine yeah, times. Oh. They have, like, a gland that's full, yeah, right? Gland. So, they so can, like, do what are the side looks. effects of that? Blindness or, like... Yeah, I mean, it could be, like, really bad damage, depending on the t what which spitter okay. it is. Okay, so, example, walking in the jungle whatever yeah. where are they from desert well i mean it depends on what type you know this you know the, the one most speakers are more like brushland okay you're walking in the brush and you kneel down to tie your shoe and then a freaking Mozambique spitter spits in your eye. Fucking spits right in both of so your what eyes what do you expect what are like what is gonna happen to you like you're like well, they're Spit. You're, you're probably like, going to go blind pretty quickly. Not necessarily permanent? permanently blind, but you Temporary. need to get need to get it that venom washed out quickly, and and you could have damage. Remember pain? Tongue, rem yeah, oh yeah, hell yeah. 
Uh, not, That's why I'm asking. Yeah. So you remember Tun Jones uh, from yes. Auction Hunters on Where Spike is this TV? Going? This is he actually got spit in the eye, and he had permanent eye damage. Whereas I was like messed up. He was in up, the yeah. wild or you got messing some. with the... Uh, what's that? You got some too? Uh, no, I've never been... I always wear goggles. He's got right. goggles yeah, so. and a plexiglass. Yeah. So, what, <laughs> so uh, yeah, he somehow got spit in the eye and years ago, like 10, 15 years ago, and he's got permanent eye damage and can't see out of one eye very well. So it doesn't like melt your eyeballs or anything cool. No, like it's that. not like yeah, you no, lose it's not your like eye, acid. You get a glass that would be awesome. Eye. Yeah, like just like melt like Marble. Yeah, it just melts your face. Melts your face. That would yeah, be sweet. Be yeah, so like it's like acid. not even that bad. It's no. just like little, <laughs> No, it's pretty bad. It's pretty it can be what? pretty bad. Yeah. <laughs> and then I just wipe it <laughs> right. and then it goes and you're away. That's good. Exactly. Yeah. Not that bad, guys. Remember it's not that bad. You know what that uh you know what that you know, I disagree. No worries. <laughs> I disagree. You know that that uh, when Stuart did this, when Stuart did this and, and covered his eyes, that reminded me of. Remember Rich from Animal House and the carpet python we bought when we oh were like twenty God. something years. It only had one eye. <laughs> so we, I, this guy, we wanted That's to buy a... some carpet pythons, Australian carpet pythons, and um, this was way back when we were like in our early twenties. Yeah. There was this guy named Rich from Animal House in Cleveland, Ohio. <laughs> And he had uh, a trio, a, one male and two female adult carpet pythons. So I th they weren't cheap either. They were like two grand. And that's a lot of money for us Back when, then, we're, when we were sure. kids. And so we drew, drove all the way out there and we see them and we'd show up and, and one of the females only has one eye, right? And uh, you can tell the rest of the story, Laurie. Is this a joke? No, this isn't a joke. This well, is not a joke. it's a joke, but it's a true story. But, so Brian's like, dude, like the snake only has one eye. And he's like, what? He's like, look. I only got one eye. I'll still breed. <laughs> yeah, he's like, I'll still breed. <laughs> so, uh, and we bought him. So we bought him. So we bought him. So it worked. It worked, man. <laughs> it's like shit. That salesman. Yeah. Did, did you make any money from this? Yeah, yeah weirdly we enough, we did. We, yeah, we did. She breed still them. bred. Yeah, she she bred and we produced. But a that lot was of a sales buttons. pitch. Oh, I've only got one eye. I'll still breed. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. It, it was good. It worked. <laughs> yeah, it worked out though. But so, so if you get spit in the eye, you'll be all right. Yeah, you can, that's what I'm you saying. Can be fine with it. Really eye. doesn't. What no. you're telling me, it doesn't. No, sound it, bad. it can be bad well, though. I'm sure it can be bad. I mean, you're blind. About it. You can go completely blind. It's I not, think there's a chance. I don't know for sure because I'm not an expert in spitting cobras. Jay can look it up though if you'd like. So, uh, but I think you can go permanently blind. Just, but okay. but I think Just it depends. It's, it's not enjoyable either. But way. you got to remember that cobras and, and really venomous snakes as a whole. The reason they have the things that they have, like rattlesnakes have a rattle, cobra's hood, it's to so they don't have to spit at you unless they have to. You right. know, they're not you're not gonna be I mean, tying listen, your shoe Noah, and get spit in the eye. You could you stab know, yourself in the kidney. eye with a pen yeah. and go blind. You don't want to do it. I wanna right? say something. Yes. I wanna say something. So everyone here will be scared of all of Australia, whether it be the sharks or the lizards. Yeah. You uh, should be. Snakes. Yeah. No, 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 they're great. <laughs> spiders. You know, you've been there, spiders. Oh my God, the huntsmen's, <clears throat> they're everywhere. <laughs> but they're not dangerous. But really, I would, I would walk um, in the local bushland and the local bushland where I was, for example, there was oyster shells this high and that was from Aboriginals probably i got told that's about five to ten thousand years of aboriginals going down to the water getting the oysters and eating them and i would walk through that every day for my whole really? life pretty much and there's brown snakes there there's yeah. black snakes yeah. there's i yeah. never ever really got close to the point that i ever felt scared and lizards and being uh, not lizards spiders there's the, the funnel web spider yeah worst funnel webs are tough yeah. meant to be the worst one in the world yeah, yeah. Well, I'd landscape many jobs, digging holes Ooh. and all the rest. Oh, and they're all over the place. One day Sydney, I yeah. found 25 Ooh. funnel webs yeah. in one day. Yeah. you got to be a bit careful, but at the same time, yeah, it's really you know, not as bad. So yeah. everyone who wants to go to Australia, don't stop. No, no, it's that. not bad. You know, I milked a funnel web spider once for venom. That's pretty yeah. little. Yeah, well, <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? But uh, He's not impressed. He's not impressed. Yeah, he's not impressed. <laughs> you can't but, uh, tell that story to an Australian. <laughs> yeah. But it was impressive for me because at the time I was terrified of spiders. Yes, and, it was. And, uh, I I was dying. If you yeah. saw me, I was not on film. Yeah. I was in the other side of the camera laughing, crying. Yeah. I was laughing so hard because he was so How did terrified. you hold it? Show me how you held no, it. No, so, so the thing is, honest <laughs> to God, you don't hold them, right? So, yeah. So what so, was the deal? So it's, re it's really the, it's, it, it's, sounds like impressive like i no, milk them no, no, no it doesn't so no, no so so uh, let me ask you so they don't climb right they can't climb no, they can jump a little bit yeah so there's a little acrylic just one inch acrylic 
uh, square. Yep. That's and, and now it's stuck in there. And you actually mm -hmm. take a little uh, hemostats and you piss them off and they rear up and their fangs come out and it starts to drip. Then you just take a little pipe it and you suck it off. That's, you know, that's it. That's, that's, that's all. <laughs> You suck it off. Yeah, not like that, Noah. But <laughs> it starts to milk and then you suck it off <laughs> with the pipette. <laughs> with the pipette. All right. Like you were talking about me. <laughs> I know. Jesus. Wow. Man, this hey, this is we don't, wow. we don't really do that, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, that's not how it's done. It's not how it's done. I, 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 think, I think you just keep the snakes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. What can you do? But I will say, I will say this: we uh, we're in this small room. More uh, beam, more beam, beam. More beam. <laughs> we're in this small room with uh, about uh, they, there was probably a hundred and fifty huntsmen's on the uh, in little jars. You right. know, yep. but no, there was, but interesting enough, remember Lori, there was also, I think there were, they, um, what are the, uh, the spinning orb spiders? What are they called? Uh, orb star, something. Oh, I know, anyways, I know, there are big orb spiders. About. You hate so, walking into them oh of a gosh, night They time. are horrible. You do the, so you do the, the, you do the spider dance. With oh those my ones. gosh. Yeah. So those were actually just like loose in the room. It was a room at a zoo, right? Wow. And they had all these little containers They're of fine. huntsmen's <laughs> and, and they actually did, it's the, up in Gosford, you know, yeah, yeah, the yeah, Australian yeah. reptile zoo. Yep. Um, and so they actually did the venom from the photo rebs were for anti-venine right. and stuff like that. So <laughs> we're going to go back in that story. So anyways, I, I they, they uh, dared me to hold a huntsman. And uh, and Lori loved that oh, story I too. I was crying because Aren't uh, they fast. So hard. They're super fast, oh but they're God. not dangerous. So they're just fast. And it ran up. His shut up! Shut up! <laughs> oh shut up! And it jumped on my like, arm. Shut hand. up! I was crying. It was like it was about three inches, and <laughs> it gonna... jumped on my arm <laughs> no. and ran up. I was behind the glass. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I'm not joking. Oh. I would yeah, well, rather be so dead scary. than have to deal oh, with that. I said, oh, Jay, okay. try and pull up the Huntsman in Australia. Someone posted a Huntsman literally the size of a dinner plate the other day oh from gosh. Australia. That's oh, terrifying. Yeah. Remember that viral video from... Oh, that came what, down on the... the uh, yeah, like, like at the start the, of YouTube. Yeah. Where, yeah. yeah, in Australia, it, there was one on the ceiling. And he they had like everywhere. A, a little... Everywhere. Yeah. He had a terrifying. bowl and he tried to capture it on a ladder. Yeah, and then it jumped oh, down. It jumped on his face. Yeah, that those things. Are oh hell no! Yeah. I'm not looking at that. I can't look at it. It is. They were I everywhere. I can't Noah. look at it. <laughs> it was so. Look scary. at the size of that one. That's not that's, real. That's not it real. Is that's real. That's a, yeah. there is. They that's get a that damn piece. squid. No, <laughs> oh my gosh! Is that it a has mouse? A fucking rat in its mouth, man. Holy yeah. shit, man! I'm never going. They used to. They used to come into our house all the time. They, they, we had oh, big palm shut. trees, and they'd they'd be in the palm trees and. Yeah, I actually. Yeah, that's oh, why they the say foliage. nothing will kill an Australian. I was. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it gives me the heebie-jeebies. Yeah, I was in Ipswich in Queensland, and mm -hmm. and I was staying in in the basement of uh, well main floor of the house, and was and that, with uh, Jade? that was actually no, that was with uh, um, uh, not Chris, but uh, Joy's son. What the heck is his name? I can't remember. Anyways, it doesn't matter. We uh, sorry. So I was staying in his in, in his his basement, and. Uh, Every morning I'd wake up and there'd be huntsmen's like in like in the bed, mm -hmm. in the what? shower, in, in the toilet. In your bed you were sleeping in. In the bed I was sleeping mm -hmm. in every day. And, and they yeah. did, they don't hurt you or anything Not like that. Going. I just scare you. Yeah, it's kind of freaky. No. But uh but every day you'd go to the bathroom and in like the sink there'd be a huntsman in the sink. You know, just sitting there chilling. Yeah. Or, and, but you know what? what also Close is really your freaky. doors. What is going on? Where do they well, come from? Just come, I guess. I don't know where, where they come from. Uh, Outside? Yeah. Yeah, outside they're they all over the place. They're only the skinny; they can hide, get through the door. Yeah, they can get through almost anything. And then, dude, yeah, we went out. There was these frogs that uh, actually the owner of the Australian Reptile Zoo took us out uh, at, at this little residential area, and they were looking for at least they almost look like leopard frogs. Then okay. you know, and um, so they were be in the bottom of like the bromeliad type plants. Mm -hmm. And and everyone you'd look at because we went at night, obviously go frogging. You so you have your little torch and you go in there and every single bromeliad would have a huntsman in it too. Yeah, right. so you find right. a frog maybe in once every ten, but yeah. everyone would have a huntsman spider, you know. And so it was, uh, but yeah, th it was a little freaky. I, I mean, that's the one thing. I, I got to tell you something. I only learnt the last time I went back to Australia. So here I was catching uh, eastern water dragons, which yeah, you know, beautiful yeah, lizards, yeah, beautiful. 
And um, so I'm catch used to chase them in the middle of the day, catching them. I'd go there maybe early in the morning when the sun's sun's up, and they'd be basking, and I'd go try and catch them. And then my my bigger brother Jeffrey was always into into the lizards and frogs as well. Mm -hmm. And he so here we are. I'm 50 years old at the time, back in Australia. He says, "Let's go down the creek." So we go down the creek, and he takes a spotlight with him, and um and there's all the the, the water dragons up in the trees on the branches right. and they're all asleep so you just grab them out of the trees oh my gosh and i'm catching them yeah, all my running, life yeah, like yeah. running a million miles an hour to catch these <laughs> and they're just and they're asleep in the trees like picking grapes <laughs> <It was. laughs> yeah, so oh, that was crazy they are cool i wish we could get some there's a handful of them around but very few okay you know i mean and they are they are a cool lizard you know and they're everywhere you know i mean it's uh especially if you go to the australia zoo yeah. You know, it's like, I mean, they're just running around like squirrels or something sure, like that. Sure. You know, really Tronga cool. Zoo, same. Yep. Yeah, yep. Tronga. Tronga is really amazing because uh, it's such a unique zoo, right? Because it's yeah, the back. It's the only place that I know of that you can be looking at a giraffe paddock. In and the, the in Harbour the, Bridge. Yeah, the Opera, Harbour Bridge. Opera House. Yeah, it right is in the backdrop. unbelievable. Really? It's, it's yeah. really a cool zoo. It's in the really. background of the... Yeah, because yeah, it's right so off of... Yeah, Jay, like if you can pull up... A, unbelievable. Yeah, the, like a, the Taronga Zoo's uh, backdrop. I mean, it's it's one of the coolest zoos I've ever been to, you right. know? So it's right. it's a beautiful, beautiful zoo. I, but, but I love Australia. I really do. And um, can't wait. I hope we'll be able to get back there. Oh, wow. This, uh, yeah, let's see what you got. That's yeah, it. you can kind of see the, the backdrop of the city. The it's just wow. unbelievable. Look at that. That's awesome. I mean, it's... Actually, can you go to the bird of prey, please? Yeah, oh, look at that. That's awesome. Can we do a close up? Those rock, that rock right in the middle at the back left. That's what. That's Did a universal that rock, rock. rock. Is it really? <laughs> yes. Is it really? Yes, it is. And and Lori, do you yeah. remember when we yeah. were in Darling Harbor, the uh, Crocodile World or whatever it was called? Sydney was Wildlife World. Sydney Wildlife World. He actually I did, did one. Yeah, I did. did every enclosure in that when it first opened. That was that pretty cool? cool. Remember, it was like when you looked out the window, you actually saw like a sign on top of the building that said Sydney Wildlife World or something like that. It was like kind of thing. That was really cool. Uh, that that was, was our first adventure. That's just Australia. around the corner. I go under the Harbour Bridge, around the corner to the, the left. I don't remember all the giraffes. That was in Tronga. Well, we didn't. Tronga. Yeah, that was Tronga. That was Tronga. We didn't. Okay. We didn't go to Tronga. Okay. Yeah. I, I had been a couple I don't times. Any giraffes? Here yeah, we get Australia. the kangaroos. All that exhibit I did. Oh the, my gosh. The, the um, what's that bird? What cassowary? I do cassowary. Yeah, cassowaries. Yeah. That's all, that's all our work. The here the the Big Mac, um, Big Croc. That's all you. All that enclosures I did. Wow, What's that's that? amazing. Shingleback lizard. Oh Is yeah, shinglebacks are super cool. Bobtails. Looks yeah. like an acorn. I mean, a pine cone. Like yeah, when it's like in its, it's premature wall you know state. Wallaby, yeah. wallaby section there. That the was all cement lizard. rock we did. Really, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah. It's, I mean, it's 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 beautiful down there. I can't wait to get back. I know Jay, you know, needs to go with me. I think it would be really cool. Oh, I, I'd yeah. like Lori to come again because the first time we went was really cool. <laughs> um, <laughs> you know I want yeah, to that's just what I'm dreaming of. Yeah. A vacation with you and Jay. Well, me and Jay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what's funny is... is <laughs> you know what's funny is you know, I, I shouldn't you, even... You got a video of everything, Jay. That is my life Jay. now. <laughs> yeah. You know what? I, I didn't I didn't want to even tell Lori because she would have killed He's me if I was going to say this. to Mexico. No, so this was the thing. Like, we're going to Mexico for a few days. We're going to take a few day break. Oh, that's another no. reason why we have... Uh -oh. uh, we have a, 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 a few days ahead in the vlog so we can maybe take a few days off. Cause nice, it's, it's you need real, that. Yeah, you we guys need haven't it. had that. Yeah, so we need yeah. that. But so it's uh, been a one of the adventures <laughs> I want to do is we, we went to Chichen Itzu. Sadhguru would teach you more of that too, by the way. Exactly, we need right, some I'll more of that. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we went to Chichen Itzu a couple years ago and, and uh, the guide we went with was named Vincent. Great guide. It was yeah. a it was a tour. Like there's maybe ten or fifteen people with us. He but was we just, a good guy. He was young, he was unbelievable. He was very, very passionate about that world, yeah. about yeah. educating. Yeah, so we exchanged information. So uh, I reached out to him a few weeks ago and said, "Hey, we're going to be back. We'd love to hire you for the day. Just the two of us. Take us." Because he has so said that we. What, what sort of t what are you going to the beach? You going to the jungle? Yeah, so we're do you, going to do a, go? like just a resort and okay. out, you know, Cancun, you know, Riviera All Maya. Yes. Yeah, yeah, just to yeah. chill out for a couple so days, I'm, decompress. I'm going to the beach. She's going with, to the with, beach with all drinks included and food. Yeah, nice. and and there's and a place called like Crocacoon that's really cool. He's that's, trying to take me off, but he'll yeah, probably so be so going on adventures on his own while I'm at the beach. So, so be, although Chichen Itzu <laughs> is an amazing place. 
Yeah. And it's really unbelievable to go it check cool. it out. It's just there's a lot of people. There's tourists, right? Yep. So Vincent said, hey, I can take you to some archaeological Mayan ruins that no one mm. goes to. I like so that. we'll be alone. And I was like, I'd yes. Mold, I'd mold that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so, of course, because you'd want to make molds. Yeah, you'd want to yeah. <laughs> take latex. Yeah, right. take latex. Uh, so, so I'm like, that sounds good. So he ends up uh, telling me, I've got this adventure we can do. We can go to this ruin. This ruin is like an hour and a half away. This he goes, but I got something that's really cool. He said it's about a three hour drive. And we have to wait till sunset. <laughs> it's a hole in the ground. Right. Yeah, exactly. No, you're going to be living for the rest of your life. <laughs> Look at Noah, as young as he is, knows the deal there. Yeah. <laughs> That's not what you do in Mexico. No, so, <laughs> so he said there's there's a cave. I, I oh, even yeah. better. <laughs> of course you would go. go. You know yeah. what? Got me. Maybe, got me yeah. maybe you and yeah. Stuart should go. So there's a cave. He said, it's about, he said it's about a two-mile hike into the jungle. Oh, there's oh a yeah. Cave. No, I'm not. This is how every... <laughs> horror movie starts with a murder exactly. so but the, and he watches I know, them I, know. I don't and i know and he so watches them. i'm so the point Crazy. is is that he said we we hike into the jungle we <laughs> we stay at this cave and at dusk you know, all the bats come out but this cave he says 99 percent. every time he goes he go, takes people there all the time they always come back i hear but uh <laughs> that's what they tell you that's what they tell you but he said 99 percent of 99 yeah. you don't you're not gonna be close to him but 99 percent of the time see you see these snakes will come at dusk and eat the bats and eat the bats mm, they'll actually I've pick the bats on. off so i was thinking That'd be cool so i originally i was thinking well i should probably fly jay down to film this with oh, me oh i would freaking kill you <laughs> <laughs> so anyways i might i still want to do it i may be doing it alone and you i may and be Jay filming it by can myself go back what? and yeah. have your own lovers <laughs> little, little cancun adventure <laughs> what, what, kind of, what kind of snakes like I, I don't know some it'd probably be some boas i'm imagining that's snakes. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, bat snakes. Yeah, bat snakes. <laughs> bat snakes. I'm not sure bat what type eater, of snake. Bo Borneo bat eaters. Of Borneo course. bat eaters. Yeah, but we're not in Borneo. But anyways, uh, 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 Sunny Walls. Uh, thank you for Brian uh, for helping me save snakes. Thank you, you for Brian. Thank you, Brian, for helping me save snakes. You saved uh, my first snake four years ago with your videos. Thank you so much. Seriously, thank you for your support. Uh, Larry L. Uh, can a snorkel corn snake breed with the retic? I mean, if you no. try hard enough, <laughs> try hard enough. Anything no. is possible. Go ahead. I mean, you never, you never know, but I, 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 usually you can't breed like a rat I mean, snake with listen, a colubrid with a python or something layers, like that. So anything's possible. I mean, I'm not going to say you can't do it because some crazy <laughs> stuff has been bred together. Uh, Taylor Van Camp. Spaghetti um, and garlic bread. Hell yeah, Taylor. Uh, watching this while some Can we get some? I know, bread. I'm right? hungry. Now I want to go to Carrabba's. I'm just amazed people are still listening to Saturday. us. I know, right? Yes, yeah, 650 people listening <laughs> to us right now. Uh, Larry L., please get Eric Chamber plushies oh, for the Lord. gift shop. Oh my Lord, goodness gracious. Larry, uh, Tasha, love, love you it. guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate People want you guys. Noah and Eric. You know what? Plushies. Well, you get on yeah, that. Well, that's then, crazy though. Not, I that's will. Insane. Do it. Do and it. we'll sell them. Yeah. At yeah. your own website. Lori's doing a good shop. job with the gift <laughs> no, shop. Though. Not at the gift shop. That's what's going to be new for you guys. You're going to have a gift shop, aren't yeah. you? Yeah. Yeah. I'm really excited about that to have a space instead of just the little cabinet. I wonder what I could make for you. See volcanoes, oh. volcano, <laughs> Vol volcano kit, yeah, volcano. a volcano Don't. kit. I know. That's, That's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's what I, I was talking. I agree. See? No, I Stop. agree. Oh, no. Now you agree. No, yeah, I know. I do. I agree. I'll come. We'll How go down. It? We'll build. We'll we'll get our prototype of the volcano kit, yeah. and then we'll have to get the dimensions for our podcast cave. Yes, we're gonna call it the cave. The cave. Yeah. yeah. That's where we All podcast right. out of. And and yeah. I tried to get Lori to let me have your table, too. Your rock table. Mm, that's sensational. In the cave. Mm, sensational. You like that. sensational. I like that, yeah. too. Yo. That's <laughs> sensational. I like that. We Like, our table will be a rock. That's We're, what I'm saying. Even... If it's you like want the, a podcast to stand out, you, you need know. a rock table. I definitely yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no, question. no rock table, yeah. but like right, not I'm like out. a. I'm out. Yeah, I yeah, that's fine. Damn podcast, that's fine. We like, can talk about this. Yeah, we can. <laughs> yeah, we can. Yeah. Like you know, uh, so not like the walls of the reptarium were like brown and stuff. Yeah, like a 
a flat gray rock. Well, well, actually, his table. I, do you have a picture of that anywhere on Instagram or anything? This table, you would no. like it seriously. Okay. It's like it's like a flat. It almost looks like a piece of it's, like big it's a slate piece of type. Rock. Right? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, yeah. It's a rock. Table. Just a rock. Is that exactly. how you see it? Just a rock. It's just, just a flat rock table. A flat rock. It's a beautiful flat. Rock. It is a, a beautiful flat rock. Jay, can you pull up that palm tree really quick that you just come down? Wait, we're talking about tables now. Palm I know, trees? and now we're on palm trees. So I want to. I wanted we to just put that. I put that in last week with one guy in a restaurant, a friend of a friend, well, a, and a business Middle. associate. He just put Brian, open up a restaurant. Brian's trying to put two outside the. I reptarium. want two outside it's, the reptarium. It looks awesome. Yeah, I think it's two it outside does. the reptarium. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. I agree. <laughs> yeah, we just have to get approval by the city, and it's something that I just I've been so busy I haven't I done. But so I, again, I want to do the palm trees out front. I want to do the snake up the pole. Uh, just, just, I mean, listen, you know, got to go big. So much. much got to go hard. How much, how much traffic comes past this place? Oh my gosh. A lot. T tons. So I mean, so much. As long as tens of thousands. Tens of, yeah. Blocking the traffic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, in the course of a day, there's thousands and thousands of vehicles. Yeah, I'm sure yeah. there's 40,000 cars yeah, go probably, past yeah. in a day. A day, yeah. You yeah. know, so. And still we get people every weekend, and Laura, you know this, that people go <laughs> like, yeah, I just drove by and I just saw it. You know, I didn't even know what this was or, yep. you know, and, 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 and yeah. we've been here for 15 months and still people are maybe you are should just, do what the the insurance people do put someone out there with a sign yeah we, spinning, you know, we, we, did. we actually have we a lizard suit we have a lizard suit yeah we've only done our it one once, year though. anniversary we, we had my niece yeah. wore the gecko I suit think, with I think us you should do it more often look <laughs> look at our iguana on the left that, that's max's oh, that's, iguana, that's on the left. iguana yeah he's not wrong we should do it more often all right noah there's your we could no we could build i'm busy i'm busy we could build you a suit like that Oh my gosh! Could and you, you could just walk along the side of the footpath. Yeah, yeah there you yeah. go. Yeah, anything to On bring all in traffic. fours. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> exactly. So obviously, look at these glowing logs. Yeah, what we is make. that? They're just what the heck is that? wait. What like, the hell? Are, wait. No, no, no. Let's oh, watch. No, no, no. Who, who wants to look at what? <laughs> I want to look now we're just right. looking at everything these on the Instagram glowing, page. Like these this are is glowing logs. So they they're the logs that you've got that I just put at the front door. Yeah. But okay. with like phosphorus or something? But or? I'm using less color in them and then we put a really light. bright light in the back and they glow of a night. So oh. in the daytime in the daytime you don't even That's know. That's awesome. But of a nighttime they look yeah. like that. And we've got rocks like that too. What's that next? They were to mangroves. It? They that. went in an aquarium to look like what man is it? mangrove roots. What is a mangrove root? Mangrove. It's a, it's a like tree. On the, on the, mangrove tree. On the salt water. On the like down in Florida, you'll it see mangrove trees. It looks like a damn alien. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a little bit freaky. Yeah. Well, that's because it's got a pox. Should we it. put that in Bowser's pond? No. 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 He doesn't go in salt <laughs> no. water. Yeah, no, he no. doesn't go in salt water. <laughs> no. Uh, Just a no. So March 13th. Uh, are we going to be ready? I mean, I think we're way ahead of schedule, actually. I mean, we've Let's got... Let's keep it that way. Well, we got to keep it that way, yeah. So, Stuart's gone tomorrow. We've got uh, the a boys in from today. Canada and Buffalo are going to be here tomorrow a little bit. And then we are just <laughs> a solo after that. But we've got a lot of time. Well, I think we're going to be in good shape. I think we're going to be in good shape. you got to cover it now. You know now's what? now's it'll really be, fun time. It'll be yeah. fine. We'll get whatever. But you know what? We were The Reptarium was open, and it still evolved. You know what yeah. I mean? We still yeah. added. We still we are yeah, now it's gonna still be, yeah. doing things. Yeah. So like you know, it every, never stops. Exactly. It's not like you're done. Yeah. It's like you're you're always improving. It, Will it, it be finished? Finished no, by the thirteenth? No, there's enough but for exactly. people, everyone to see. It'll be functional. And that, that new whole area at the evolving. front is yep. huge yeah. improvement. Yeah. yeah, you're gonna yeah. have you're gonna have heaps of people oh, yeah. that'll have not be squashed. Yeah, exactly. And then your party room, your massage your massage rooms a bit kinky. Yeah, that's crazy, yeah. man. That's some crazy <laughs> shit right there. It's kinky. I mean, you got you got well, fish, you you got you fish nibbling your feet. You got mass <laughs> snakes massaging you. Like you guys are really sick. We're pushing yeah. the envelope, man. We're pushing. It's all him. Just wait it's until all the... him. I was not on board. Just well, wait I can. The next... I, I'm, I'm a Dude, reluctant. <laughs> you know, every night you guys are gonna go home, and I'm gonna just be sitting there with my feet in that fish body. You know, <laughs> yeah, right? yeah, yeah you will. Not yeah. me. You will. I know you like that on your exactly. feet. Exactly. It's going to be good dope. But it is. We're all it is gonna crazy have how many people that, want to <laughs> are excited to try it. You know how you know? I mean, that that that's yeah. going to be popping, and I think the snake massage, at least for the the start, is going to be popping as well. And that's why we put the window in there, you know, because we don't want people getting any <laughs> any ideas what's going to happen in that room, you know. I was going to tell you though today, like I went in there at some point, and remember how we were talking because we've got all these water features now, yeah. so it is loud with like water which is nice it's just gonna make you but pee. like 
But no, but when you went in that room, that door wasn't even shut. Like they did a really good job of with soundproofing. the soundproofing. Yeah, yeah because yeah. I couldn't believe when I just walked in there to get like yeah. the M M10 M1. or M1, M1 <laughs> whatever. M18. The tuba cock. M16. <laughs> and I was like, wow. Like even with the door, and I shut the door and I'm like, wow, this is really yeah. soundproof, really yep. good. That's where, Which, you, yeah. that's where you can go when you're like mad at Eric. You oh, just need to cool 100%. off a little bit. Just and close I can the just, door and just put on, because I already have the C Escapes or whatever on my phone. Like I was just yeah. about to say, no. <laughs> you can put on the Yogi. <laughs> the yogi. On, yeah. my, on my Apple Music, I've got like the sound of the water running. <laughs> Oh <laughs> just the gosh. relaxing for those really bad days. I could just go in there and turn that on and yeah. kind of find my zen and then come out and kill Eric. <laughs> yeah. You got it, you got it covered. Mm, yeah. I think we got it good. <laughs> I, I think, think so gonna, too. It's going to be pretty wild though. I mean, it's uh, it, and it goes back to what we were saying earlier about the experience when you walked in and you saw people experiencing mm, holding. It was real. I, I want to not, I want to still continue to offer not only that experience with more animals getting a chance to now with the albino, you know, crimson iguanas and, and so many different things that we can now let other people, but and now. the other ones we got today. Oh yeah. Well, we can't say about that. Let's not talk about those yet. We can't talk about those yet. I'm excited. I know. I am excited about it's those. It's one of the few ones that I actually wanted. Yeah. I think that when we got, <laughs> yeah, we'll talk about this later, but uh, yeah, I, I knew you were going to like those. So, so that was really cool. So it's a lot more animals, but then to have the experience, like I said, the fish, bah, mm -hmm. the, yeah. you know, what, whatever the case is, uh, we wanted to give more experiences. Mm -hmm. The yeah. sloth. Yeah, the sloth no, experience. No, there's no sloth. Think about, <laughs> there's no, no sloth. Think about this. <laughs> the you know, stuff sloth in the in a kind of cage. <laughs> but think about the think about the sloth. It'll be hanging from the rafters. <laughs> think about a sloth experience, though. Seriously, you know what? Let's, how let's, insane that will be. Let's move on to the birthday party room because that's going to be amazing. That'd be good for kids. And it's such that'd a be... nice large bathroom. That we're <laughs> <adding>. <laughs> well, you can experience the large bathroom at the rep camp. You're going to need that after the snake massage. <laughs> Oh, yes. Yeah, so. Oh, what's that even mean? I don't. I, know. I don't know what that means. I don't know, but I have you're no idea what that. Means. I really don't know what that means. They're your parents. Right? No, <laughs> no. Not, mine. not me. I don't even it's know what that him. means. Really, seriously. I, no <laughs> <laughs> I just that's said all it. You, Listen, <laughs> that's fucking weird. Let's go on to the next yeah, thing. I think, you know, I think I've got to go soon. Catch a plane. Yeah, we do have to catch a plane. Let's take a few questions before we're out of here, though. Uh, let me just uh, wrap up the thing. Jason A. Eric Plushy needs to happen with the pull string. Absolutely, pull strings are much. Frankie um, Lori loves sloth. Hashtag start that every pod or every uh, vlog I do from now on. Hashtag, hashtag Lori loves sloth. Mm -hmm. Uh, yes. Okay, Ashley, uh, what animals are the oldest and which animals uh, has Brian owned the longest? Stuart, uh, what do you miss most about Australia? You can answer that. My now family. Answer. Your family? My okay. family, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. America's fantastic, mind you. We we only came here for two years, my wife and i got four, chi four kids, mm -hmm. about to have our first grandchild. And uh, it's pretty exciting. We're not planning to live back in Australia, which is okay. weird because we come from both – really close families mm. and um we just had everyone over here about a yeah. year and a half ago yeah, for, for two wedding. two weddings two yeah, weddings it's amazing. Yeah. the eldest boy ben got married with amy and then and and then wow. jake and um bruna that's insane we did one a week, wedding a week I apart how, i don't know how that happened celebration <laughs> of a lifetime it oh really, i bet really was so i bet so we really my wedding is going to be yeah. fun when yeah, that uh, as far as the oldest animals, I don't know. I mean, we have a lot of stuff that we've had a long time. We've had, I mean, it's, I don't even know. We have so many animals. I'm not sure what that would be. Speedy's so, pretty uh, old. Um, Spe <laughs> Speedy, yeah, he's, he's getting up there too. Yeah. yeah, but we have a lot of snakes that are in their 20s and stuff like that getting chair. We have a, a Walmart python that's probably 24, 25 years old now that's definitely getting up there and stuff like that. So That's almost um, as long as you've ever ha had the business. Uh, well, we bought uh, the Woma. At uh, it's it's interesting. Uh, we Walmart got a Python picture. Were, yeah, Jade yep. was a baby. Yeah, yeah. Or, I mean, Jade was young when Jade, that was yeah. a baby. I think <sighs> yeah. she was in like kindergarten. Yeah, so she picture? was probably like six, four, five, something like that. Yeah. I remember we bought that pair of Walmart Python. Now Walmart Pythons are maybe two hundred fifty. Oh yep, my god, two hundred fifty, three hundred. Those were some we, of the first so yeah. much money. I we, mean, we, we, what the heck just happened? <laughs> Your mic we just, broke. <laughs> my mic just broke. Good we job, actually, Brian. You talk um, so much, you broke the damn mic. We actually, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, oops. We actually paid like fifteen grand for them. 
So yeah. it was crazy. I remember being so stressed they're out. But yeah, we still a, they're everywhere in Australia. Yeah, yeah. So we <laughs> uh, we unfortunately we uh, we we still have the the female from all those years ago. That's cool years. though. Yeah, it's pretty mm-hmm. cool. And she produced a, a ton. Now she's just done. She just doesn't. You know, she's too old to produce now. Unfortunately, um, tur- two headed turtle named Marco and Polo. That's actually not bad. Marco and Polo. Ping and Pong. Or two head- That's funny. Yeah, Ping and Pong. What was, was the other good. one we got earlier? That one was really good. The other request for the two headed turtle. It was mm. earlier in this podcast. In the podcast, I don't know. Somebody, Lamangelo and Aurora. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But that, <laughs> I, I take that back. Like, yeah, but ping and pong I is pretty cool too. <laughs> I thought it was cooler. <laughs> That's nice, there, eh? Brian. You and your family are my heroes. You oh, guys are amazing, you. lovely. Yeah, we're we're well, so blessed you. to have. Uh, yeah, thank you. We're so blessed to have such great support with everybody. You know, I mean, it's pretty. It's thank very, you, salty very Bob. humbling. <laughs> salty Bob. <laughs> <laughs> That's his name. No, I can't Salty believe this, uh, this, this darn mic fell off. So, anyways. I know. Um, <laughs> now we're really going to have to end that? it soon. Yeah. yeah <laughs> the, mic the mic broke. Mic, yeah. yeah it says, so, anyone else have anything uh, left here? Uh, and, and like I said, in the comments, I'll also go back and, you know, we'll uh, look at the chat. And in the comments, I always spend, tonight I'll probably spend a couple hours in the comment section of this podcast as well. We can also be caught on, uh, what is Apple uh, Podcasts? Yeah, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Spotify and... That's it for right now besides okay. YouTube, but okay. I'm working on a couple other yeah. different so things. So we want right to now. be able to let you guys listen because uh, we realize this long. Also, yeah, go follow also, that though, for real. Yeah, go follow that. We really Spotify, need that. Spotify, Spotify. Checking in. Yeah. Apple Podcast. As well as the in. Clips channel that Noah's exactly. working really hard on. Checking in Clips. Yeah, checking in. I like in. on clips. YouTube. Yeah, that way, if you oh, listen, if we're an hour and a half a person, or two hours into right. a podcast. I'm not a person that listens that long, but yeah. I'll listen to little clips. Mm-hmm. So. What's the best cheese shop in Wisconsin? I don't oh, know sure. any well, cheese shops. Well, guess what? We're not from Wisconsin. I, I know so. that when you oh, drive like down the cheese. road, there's a lot of I don't quite us understand why you're giving us that question. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't know, Stuart. What would you <laughs> Well, I'd, I'd, I'd say. Oh, let's see. I like this. Oh, uh, no, baby no. Ruth for the, the sloth. Baby no, Ruth. I like that. This one's better. What's that? Kayla says, reptarium gift shop idea. Wait, wine scroll glasses? up. Reptarium wine glasses. I Ooh, am all about that. Thank a, you, Kayla. That would be cool. That. I know. That's, that's not one. the first time someone said that. So. Give me uh. some Give me some rock ideas for the gift yeah. shop. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Volcano. <laughs> right. Volcano's one, yeah. <laughs> mini hot tub for your leper a gecko. Mini hot tub. <laughs> hot tub. <laughs> could you imagine? We, that? we could make vine hammocks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That would oh, be cool. Uh, oh my gosh! I think right. of something else. Trunk, yep. uh, let's see, Brian and Sure. What's your favorite breed of snakes? Uh, morph. Uh, what's your, do you have a favorite breed of snakes? Uh, I, mean, I, I like uh, diamondback. <laughs> Two headed turtle. Oh, All diamonds are really like beautiful. That. Yeah, and they're like and they're that. from your area too. Yep. So they're beautiful in that that Sydney area is where they're from. They like it a little bit cooler. Pet I rocks. can never. I can Why never. Why don't you <laughs> sell pet yeah. rocks? What, what, that, <laughs> pet rocks. Yeah, that's not there bad. Actually, I, the guy who first did that uh-huh. made about fifteen million dollars worth of pet rocks. And you got all of the molds. Why aren't you making pet rocks? I'm not a good business <laughs> apparently do you know not. that actually that 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 guy died just a couple of years ago the pet rock the guy? pet rock guy, so yeah. i could do it yes, yes. now you he's could. done the patent's you over got, okay universe rock pet rock <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pet rocks. let us know if you could not do that you could make i don't know if you already do this you can make like mini egyptian pyramids oh yeah or clo- i don't know for what <laughs> but how cool would that be? But you could do it because it, it will bring supernatural powers to you. Right. <laughs> yeah. 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 Isn't use, that it? Like the whole pyramid, the triangle, that, the whatever, use, like the power. Right? Exactly. <laughs> yeah. And guys, do me a favor too. We're gonna put a link. Uh, I'll put a, a pin a comment here. We can get a cheese shop to sponsor cheese for the grand opening. What oh, the man. fuck? Jeez, this guy is this guy who likes the cheese, man. We could have melted cheese coming out of the volcano. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes. There Instead you go, mate. We're cheese satisfying fountain, everyone. We'll here. have it coming yeah. out of the phone. Uh, 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 I mean oh, we in Australia yeah. we don't have <laughs> We don't have cheese you can squirt out of a container. That's ridiculous. Because that's U.S. But you that's, do have, but you do have Vegemite. Vegemite. We yeah, because whatever really. the hell Which, by the way, is. I do love Vegemite. I do. You're the only American. Exactly. I am real, yeah. he, and he, and honestly, he wants to he's full of shit. He doesn't like it no, either. I lo- he just I do. does it no, I do to like think it. I'm going to give him some. Cool. And it's terrible. You I've got to, I, I, do it. I'll eat it. I love it. But I did learn how to have a lot of butter on your toast. I'll be honest with you. I know. That's how you're supposed to. I don't use butter. toast. I don't use butter, but I did. Uh, an Australian always said that you have to, to you have to, <laughs> you paint it, not spread it, or something like that. Like a small amount is, yeah, is the way yeah, to go. Right. I think that's what most yeah, Americans like make. We think none. it's like peanut pee. butter. 
No, you no, can't no. do that so like bad. peanut butter. You, you uh, but I, it's I not love Nutella it. by any means. I, I, <laughs> I think the first response is always like, oh my God, that is really horrible. But mm. like as because you it eat is. it, it's almost like beer, right? The first beer you have mm. probably doesn't Absolutely. taste good. And then I it stole, tastes great. Stole from and my I, dad's yeah. fridge. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's it's the way I it goes. But regardless, Damien said- You're drinking enough wine, so you don't need beer. Wine is better. Damien said, can you give my good friend Julia Craig a shout out? We watch religiously. Lori, you know you love Sloss. Noah, do more stuff with Eric. Y'all crack me up. Brian, you motivate me more than you'll ever know. Thank you so much, Stephanie. Uh, Joshua as well. Damien. Um, sorry for the late. Just got off work. What's up, squad? Hey, Joshua, what's going on? We're Bye. Uh, <laughs> Chad, Chad uh, we're going to give send you a, uh, a, 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 a Chad, cheese board. A, yeah, cheese board. Yeah. <laughs> Charcuterie. Charcuterie. I could, I could, charcuterie charcuterie I could, I could make board. a rock cheese board. Oh, oh that's a good go. one. That's there a good go. one. We, we got more. It's all so always much. about the rocks. I will it's also. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you put me on, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I, I will. Uh, I will. I will pin a comment, guys, with all of Stuart's information. Uh, go you. show him some love. Uh, he's amazing. Like I said, without him, we wouldn't be able to uh, do what we do. Yeah, uh, there's there's going to be future stuff. Lots and lots of future stuff. We we hope to have reptarium number three expansion going soon <laughs> that's not we'll a talk about and that, later. that note we are yeah gonna we're gonna the check part. out because i'm gonna kill you in all right three, guys. Two, one. uh you guys are amazing thank it's time you for, we go yeah. yeah thank you guys for tuning in and stuff like that we appreciate it love you guys what so a, much uh oh. yeah thank you what Stuart. A, what a pleasure thank yeah, you very thank much you. it's you awesome lovely and it was, a, it was a joy with three beers later yeah it's, it's uh, the best way to do it noah take us out man Thank you guys for checking in, and we are checking, checking out. out. Peace. Peace, guys. Peace. <laughs> <laughs>